Oh my god, I just realized I can make Katamaris in Zelda with the fusion mechanic. Oh my god! Why haven't we made Katamaris? Listen, I gotta be honest with you. I did not remember. Okay, I gotta get into this right now. Okay, I gotta get into Zelda right now. I gotta find a boulder right now. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Where's the bulbous orb? Open up the HDMI. There we go. No pr no long pre-stream. No long pre-stream. We don't have time for that. Boulder. Where's a boulder at? I gotta find a boulder. All right, do you see a boulder, chat? If you see a boulder, you gotta tell me. You're legally required by the police officers at your home. Yeah, they're there. It's okay. Don't worry about it. You know what you did. Where's a boulder? Where's a boulder? Where's a rock? There's a boulder. That counts, right? That's a rock. Okay. Now that I don't want. Apple. 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 Melon. Mushroom. Pumpkin. It's not finished yet. It's not finished. Meat. Na 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 katamari damasi. Na 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 katamari damasi. Don't let not do your best. Na 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 <laughs> How did my fruit katamari do? Hurry, I gotta bring this to the king of all cosmos. He's right there. Dad! Dad! Dad, how's my fruit orb? Dad! Dad! How's my fruit orb, Dad? Dad, what did you think of my fruit orb? Dad! Dad, what did you think of my fruit orb? I don't know who I am. Do you know of the Yuga, Yuga clan? Never heard of him. Is that right? How odd. Could have sworn I've seen you before. I knew it! I knew it was- That's- You're not my dad! You're a demon! You weren't my father! <laughs> Bitch! This was a- This was a false dad! And woe, he said unto the false prophet, for his was the word of the devil, not the word of God. I can't believe I thought that was my fucking Katamari dad. I'm so fucking mad. Well, that was a really fucking good bit. Can't believe I wasted that bit. I love my big rock Katamari. It's a good bit. It lost all the fruit. The fruit fell off. Heartbreaking. Is this where the Yiga clan... Yiga... 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 Clan is. I gotta find him. I gotta talk to him about the... They making a mess. They making a stink. Who built the fucking house here? At the goddamn tutorial? Is you... Are you taking care of the fucking... 
Are you taking care of the fucking graves? Ow, shit. You got a spiked fence. How the fuck your house look this old already, too? This is fucked up. Who living here? Sure. Who's there? Wait, you. Uh -huh. You're Link. Thought you'd ambush us, did you? Well, you're the one getting ambushed today. No? <laughs> oh, it is! The silly guy clan. Fuck off, silly guy clan. I don't have time to deal with your shit. Oh, shit. Powerful man. Johnny Strongman, aren't ya? Gotcha. You weren't expecting that, were you? You weren't? I know you weren't. Oh, shit. All my weapons are breaking. All my weapons are breaking. All my weapons are breaking. It's okay. It was worth it. I broke him too. It's okay. The man breaks me and I break the man. Brendan, your thick stick. Not my thick stick. Not my deadly repost. What in the... Excuse me, darling. Have you seen this mask? Oh, it's Pitar. Oh, Pitar, I'm here to save you and your fancy mushroom shirt and your fancy mushroom hat, Pitar. Oh, Pitar, you are safe. Forcing me to make weird outfits for them. Oh, they make flashy fashion. I'm so fucking glad to help them. And they're flashy fa- I got a fucking free mask! I'm dressed like this to confess to the woman who stole my heart. Hello, Pitar. She's probably at a stable somewhere. Well, hey, I'm glad to help you, Pitar. Hope I finish that quest whenever I find that stable. Hey, props to you, Pitar. I believe in love, too. And now I got a silly mask. What does this shit say? Oh, Yiga Clan Journal. Something from the hideout where they're making uh, earthquake technique. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Not a problem. Not my problem. Not my pig. Not my fucking farm. I would tell you if it was my pig. <laughs> I would tell you if it was my farm. Oh, I gotta fuse the blade with something, don't I? The bastard Bushido blade. Put the barrel on there. The barrel blade. Are those silly evil guys hanging out? Having a good time? That's a lot of silly evil guys hanging out, having a good time. Can I, uh, maybe fuck with them a little bit? What if I shot a cannon at you? Would that be fucked up? I missed. Oh, you know what? I've only fought... That didn't kill them, did it? It did not. Okay, this was a silly idea. Yep, this was a decidedly silly idea that I've done here. Maybe, maybe if I had smarted a little bit, been a little bit bigger brain when I was fighting these guys. Not possible, though. I don't know what that did. I stabilized that enemy good. Shit. Got him. There's at least one. I was kind of hoping to get the thick stick off those enemies, but never mind. I'll just take I'll just take my L. I'll take my L. Really wanted his thick stick, but I burnt him all, so literally just I should ignore them. Just trying to get a thick stick from that enemy, but that's just I don't want this. 
I want the spring. Oh, wait, no, I don't want the spring. Get rid of this. Doesn't even do anything cruel. How do I... Where's the... There we go. That's what I want to put on this son of a bitch. You can't take that out now. Yes, I can. Where are my eightfold blade? Now it does way more damage because it's an eightfold trident. Ha ha! Folded your blade a bunch more. What are you going to do? Folded your... I just folded your blade so much, dude. An insane amount of folding just went under your blade. What are you going to do about it? Folded a thousand times, huh? What about a thousand and one? Maybe grow up a little bit. How's your day been, Brendan? Uh, I don't know. I streamed Zelda. And then I hung out with my wife for for a while, which is pretty fun, and I liked it. And then we ate Indian food. And then I got a balloon. Pretty good here. Pretty good. Uh, and then I, I drank some boba tea, and that was pretty good. And then I... This is literally just like a... And then I... Just like naming off things I did. And then I... I don't know. Uh, just a chill, chill day. Nothing crazy. Nothing, nothing insane. Just a normal chill day. And then I poop my pants. What kind of boba you get? Tiger milk boba. I'm just like that guy, Charlie's Sheen. I'm just like him for real, for real. Because I drink tiger milk as well. Cool rock hammer. Cool guts. Cool horns. What are uh what are these rock patterns doing? Is this loss? Did Nintendo pre No, but I could make it loss. For a second I thought Nintendo pre made loss. It's is a fucking Korok puzzle. Oh, there's two rocks. Ah, oh, there's the other one. There's two rocks missing. I got tiger blood. I got fucking tiger blood boba. Very good. There, am I done? Fuck you, Korok. I got the new leak amiibo. Now you can need a P.O. box so I can send it to you for your birthday next month. I already bought it. GameStop had a bunch left over for some reason. I ended up getting it. I ended up getting it uh, just randomly pretty much because they literally had eight of them left. And I was like, yeah, it's, they're out online everywhere. Why do you just have them in store? And they're like, I just got them. Like, just have a bunch. So I was just like, fuck yeah. So I got it now. Uh, all it's dropped for me so far is I think a linen... And then the thing is that it drops. When I say thing is that it drops, I mean the, um... The fabric for the paraglida. I want... Nope, I picked that back up. I want apples and pies. Apples and pies. Apples and pies. Apples and pies. Where's the Octorok balloon? Because I wanted to fuse that to a shield to see how that do. Oh, hell yeah. It just worked like that. See, this how shit should just work. Oh, shit. Scary guys. At least they still got their hats. Free hat. Free hat. Free weapon. There, y'all done? Because what I'm about to do is put a moblin arm. What do you mean fuse is already... Oh. Moblin arm on a moblin arm. I got two arm damage weapon. Real. A lot of power for a silly weapon like that. A lot of power for a silly guy like you. Hand on a stick. Hey! 
Max Scratcher! Get your... Max Scratcher! You. Do you need your back... Wait, sorry. Do you... Sorry. Do you need your... Oh, sorry. I'm so embarrassed. Do you... Do you need... Do you need your back scratched? By my back scratcher. Link turning around, shy, embarrassed, plump. Do you need... I wonder if the horse still spawns here. I'm curious about that. I want to see. Do they still got the big horse over here? Or is he somewhere else? I got him in my stable. I got the big haunts in there. Scary night. God is real. Oh, no! No, no, come over here, don't! No! Don't come over here, by the way. Hey, fun fact. If you're looking for the big horse, don't come over here. Don't do it! I don't know what the fuck that is. I don't know what the fuck those are, but I know that even if you defeat the hands, it literally summons Ganon. So if you see the scary red thingus, fucking run. If you see the scary hands, they are your they should be your number one concern. Is that a triangular wheel? What does that do? No, it's just a normal wheel. Just realize uh, Breath of the Wild is half a decade old at this point. Uh, 2017. Uh, so 2023, three years since Breath of the Wild in 2020, six years from three years from 2023. So Breath of the Wild is six years old, six years. That is, uh, yeah, a little more than half a decade. You're correct. Old fucking game, old fucking console. Nintendo Switch. Are those, are those motherfucking... Oh, those motherfucking tumbleweeds. Oh, am I too hot? Or am I cold? Oh, I'm too cold. That's fine. Peas porridge hot. Peas porridge cold. Peas porridge in the pot nine days old. Damn, dude. I want to put the tumbleweed on my weapon. I want to be the real cowboy. Cowboy out here fighting his wife, beating her up with tumbleweed. Have you seen... I'm just a kindly little cowpoke. I just like to... Hang around and have a good time just like anybody else. Gotcha. What do I even put on a boomerang? If I put something on a boomerang, will it stop being a boom or a rang? What if I... What if I unboom the boomerang? Does it still boom and rang? It still booms, it still rangs. Fun little fact, if you find a boomerang and you put a thingus on it, it still booms, it still rangs. Put an Octorok guy on it. I'm so hungry, I could eat an Octorok. I'm so Octoroted, I could eat a hungry. Oh, that tower so I can see what the, like, m big Dungan are. There's a fucking fire down there. There's a fire right down there. Uh, so we'll see if we can get that. Is it is it like frozen? Is that why everything is fucked up in the desert? Oh, the desert is frozen. I get it. Uh, I see. Is that a oh a shrine crystal? So I gotta find out where that goes to. Neat. Look at these fucking guys. Look at these fucking guys. Stop. Stop. 
silly guy. Come here. Come here, fucker. Nice throw, dude. That was really an epic... That was an epic hit, not gonna lie. Epic throw, epic hit. Come here, dude. Already drops board. I got enough room for that. Wait, no, and now I have enough room for it. There we go. Give me your shit. Oh, that's right, because I, I was in... Yep, I forgot I was in the cold. And I ate a different buff. Oh, well. Are enemies supposed to almost kill you in one hit, or is Brennan in a high-level zone? I feel like I've been in the high-level zone. Like, way too long, not gonna lie. I feel like every area feels like a high-level zone. If it feels wrong for some reason. Everywhere I go is a high-level zone. I don't know why it be like that, but it do. But it decided to be like that, but it do just for me exclusively. Definitely got that be like it be how it do how it do feeling everywhere. Why this man... Okay, why do you have a crystal over there for a shrine? What's up, dude? Ah, ah, Arr. so thirsty. The only thing scarier to me than a desert is a really cold desert. Follow the beam to its end and offer the crystal there. Do so and I will offer you a light that banishes evil. Thank you. There's a fire corning through my veins. Eat me a sandwich and then fuck me out my brains. Let me see. Uh, there should be a steering wheel around here somewhere. I'm feeling it. I see a car. I see a car. The tumbleweeds will keep you warm. You ready for a big bowl of sassafras? Let me see. Do this. Ha <laughs> car. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no, I want to... Oh, I can't take the steering wheel off of there. I have to build... That's fine. I, I can splash... I can slot them together. I think this is all the same way. There we go. They're all going the same way now. Okay, the car works. Cool. But it needs camouflage. I don't want the enemies to be able to see me. This car needs camouflage. I need to keep myself safe. Safe from the people trying to do me harm. They'll never be able to tell. They'll never fucking know. That this famous meat car is actually me. I can't fucking believe the famous... The famous Iowan meat car! I finally get to drive it! There we go. We're putting bling bling on the wheel. Call me crazy, but Mimi, I think I just made the meat mobile. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Meat Ghost. Let it be a part of your spirit. May the meat be with you, and also with you. Raw meat on the left side, raw meat on the right side. How about a couple of little horns for this vehicle? There we go. Give me some more bling, dude. Now we're cooking with raw meat, good looking. Famous Iowa meat car. 
Driving in my meat car, I will get so meat far. Near and wide, they'll all scream. They think I might deliver ice cream, but it's time for the meat car, the meat car, the meat car. I fucking love making meat car. In Breath of the Wild, you couldn't make a meat car. In Tears of the Kingdom, you can make a meat car. There are pros and cons to every video game. There is definitely a lot more pros. I can't... I, I've, I literally filled the vehicle up with meat. The, the game said you can't attach anymore. There's too much meat on the meat car. You ready to adventure with me on the meat car? Do you think... Do you think if this thing pulled up in front of your house, would you run out there and get a big Salisbury steak or what? Would you run outside and say, yo, 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 fuck, fuck, stop, stop, stop. Is that the meat car? You know what I thought when I was a kid? You know the Schwann's food truck that delivers like meals? I thought when I was a kid that old people ran outside and screamed at the Schwann's meal truck like kids do at an ice cream truck. <laughs> I thought they were like, yo, 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 they got Salisbury steak outside. Yo, fuck yo. I <laughs> Hurry, honey, grab your wallet. They got flatbread pizzas on sale on the Schwans. Liver and onions. Liver and onions mode, real. They got the Salisbury steak TV dinner with the good mashed potatoes. Old people standing outside in their gated neighborhood as the Schwann's truck pulls in, lined up on the side of the street yelling, Schwann's, 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 Schwann's. Uh, can you fucking believe it, honey? Schwann's. I'm trying to deliver some meat to some old people in need. There are creatures in the desert, and I gotta get this to them. Listen, this is an all-terrain vehicle. Oh, this is an all-terrain vehicle. One second. Uh, one second, meat car. I'll be right back. I love you, meat car. I love you, meat car. The awful thing about meat car is it's really fucking up my frame rate. But I love you, meat car. I'm coming back. I got two presents to deliver. Where's your friend? Oh, they're just right up here, dude. That's not even that far. Come on, dude. I'll give you a ride in the meat car. Don't worry. The government can't censor us anymore, my little buddy. No longer will we adhere to their uh, capitalist demands. Like, don't make a meat car. Don't make a car made entirely of meat. Don't ride it around outside. No more, my young friend. We will not be held by the bounds of capitalism. No more will we, we, we be a, a prisoner to our freedoms. No, my friend. You get a ride inside the fucking meat car. No more will we be held down by those who wish to hold us and those who wish to fold us. Yes, stay in the meat car, young friend. I will deliver you. To where are you being delivered? I'm not telling you. But stay inside the meat car at all... What did I say? Didn't I literally say stay inside the meat car at all times? Fine. I'll just bring you over here. I don't even care. There's your friend. He's vaping in the big hookah. Okay, Korok, 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 and meat car is a little bit fucked up. It's fine. We can flip the son of a bitch. There we go. All right, and then I need my crystal back. I need my crystal bag for the meat car. Sausages, ham, turkey, chicken, beef, roast beast, all this and more you can find at your local Brent Daniels meat car. But be wary, there will be villains outside, always trying to steal your precious meats. So remember, protect yourself with a brand, like a brand Daniel, Brent Daniel incendiary device, just in case you need to defend your meat car. 
Stay. Brendan, I was watching the VOD from earlier. Now I'm, I, I, I'm blessed with the Battlefield Feast of Live, Brendan. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, you're watching Meat Car in action. I got I got to go and grab the crystal, though. Meat Car is a little bit, uh... It's okay if I just take a little meat off the meat car, right? It's okay. The world will still be balanced if the meat car is just one meat smaller, yes? Just one little meat. Who will it hurt? Who will it hurt? One wheel of meat. Who will it hurt? Time for the meat car. I didn't hurt the meat car and I will get far. Please don't report me to my meat car, boss. He'll get really mad and he won't let me drink sauce. My meat car has a first name. It's B-R-E-N-D-N. -E my meat car has a second name. It's Brendan once again. We did it. All right. Goodbye, meat car. I'll miss you. Imagine if, if there was an episode of The Simpsons where Carl became Meat Carl. I want my meat back, though, for future meat cars. I'm not letting it get I'm not letting my meat get wasted in the hot sun. I'm refrigerating in my backpack like a normal good Midwesterner. You don't let your fucking meat get out there in the sun. You gotta you gotta refrigerate it in your backpack like a good Midwesterner. Brendan has once again gone to prison for meat car embezzlement. Heartbreaking. What did you have to say, Brendan? What do you have to say for yourself, Brendan? For meat, meat car embezzlement against the company of meat car. I, uh, I'd like to apologize to the pork chops, the lamb chops, the chickens, the turkeys, the beef, the stew, the pork, the ham, all of it. I want to apologize to all the meat. What if meat Carl in the Simpson friend with Lenny? Hey, Lenny, I'm meat now. Please don't tell people how I live. What the fuck? Oh wait, I mixed up Lenny and Carl, you're right. Fuck. Not Lenny! Uh, gee, Lenny. Looks like I've made a meat now. Fuck. Hey, uh, Homer, pass me one of those brewskis. Uh, meet Carl. <laughs> anybody else fucking, anybody else have the problem where immediately sometimes when they think of food, they think of the fucking Homer Simpson gurgle? <laughs> this man be salivating. He be going... <laughs> Core. <laughs> I have something for you, Lenny Simpson. Just don't tell Carl. Just don't tell Carl, Lenny. Have you, has anybody seen You Got the Dud? One second. I'm fucking... I'm a little high, so I... <laughs> Is any, this is, this is, okay, I, I, I shouldn't show YouTube videos on Twitch, but this video, I, this fucking video has been in my brain all week, so we're going to watch it together as a family. You get the dud, and you get the dud, and you get the dud.
I love that video so fucking much. It's so fucking good. It's been living rent free in my head uh, all fucking week. That's been that's been my current like brainworm is the you got the dud video. I keep getting it recommended to me on the on the on the tiki taki. Sick of seeing it at this point, but fuck has it been in my head regardless. I got four orb. It's fucking thog, dude. Ready to watch the sequel to Hey Richard, I Smashed Your Phone? No. Hey Richard, I smashed your phone. You can't fucking do this to me. You can't remind me of that fucking video. Where like the guy fucking screams like, You can't do this to me. You can't remind me of that fucking video. There was a, I, God, was it a fucking, it was one of the boys trips that I went on. And like, they kept fucking playing that video and then yelling it. And then playing that video and then yelling it. Let me tell you, I'm fucking cursed with that video. Hit me. It worked. Boy, 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 boy. Boy, 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 boy. Years later and I still don't get it. The You Got the Dud video? It's the way it's an actual so the You Got the Dud is like a it's like an actual bit in The Simpsons. And it's like a card that they got, and then they make fun of the fact that it looks like Millhouse. But Homer makes a specific face when he you got the dud, when like the hey, you got the dud, that's the face Homer makes. And it's a really weird, slow smile and grin. And that's why that video was made is because it looks fucking weird. And it looks like Homer got pod personed. So they kind of make it all about the pod person potential instead. Please don't be a scary ninja. You literally are a scary ninja, aren't you? Oh, never mind. Cool off on some cool elixirs. Thanks, gamer. I love making cool elixirs. I'm a big fan of them. Tinctures, potions, elixirs. Elixirs, elixirs, tinctures, potions, elixirs. All of it's good. I am all. I'm gonna chill off in the shade. The heat be getting to my brain. Actually, I should make a portable pot, and then I should make a, a, a nice cool meal. Cool meal! One watermelon. And how about a whole bunch of meat? Cool meal. Need me a cool meal. Feeling good, feeling good. Got me my cool meal. Yumby. Just chilling out here with my really cool meal. Wait, the first scary ninja you encountered looked like that guy? Oh, the guy who was talking about elixirs? More than likely. Everybody loves elixirs, elixirs and tinctures, even the bad guys sometimes. I wonder if the Trumbleweed have something in them. Like, just do be like Minecraft. They ain't got nothing in there. I got no fruit in the Tumbleweed? This is fucked. He's eating meat! Stop. Right there. Oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. Got him. Fucking idiot fell for it in my boomerang trap. He was having a good time with that meat, though. He was losing his fucking mind. Mans was literally gobbling that shit up. Oh, shit. Don't fire. I dot What in the goddamn? How'd you even kill me? What did you... What did I get fucking hit with? I don't even know what the fuck touched me. I'm not gonna lie to you. No fucking idea what even touched me. I think he had a big stick and he poked me with it. And now I'm upset. Oh, do I get free meat eating now? Free meat eating? HT meat eating lizard. Are you eating a meal? Oh, he's not eating a meal this time. This little dude's eating a meal. Oh, look at him. Look how fucking scrumptious that looks. 
He loves he fucking raw meat. He fucking loves it, he does. Oh, what a little meal boy. Making himself sick off the fat of the land he is. Too bad I have to kill him. What a horrible day to have a meal. Oh shit. Come here. What a horrible day to have a meal, eh, boy? I know you can hear my thoughts, boy. Well, uh, let's see. Sort this. Gotcha, bitch. I literally froze you. I'm so fucking sorry. Literally frozen. I'm so fucking sorry. Locked you in the frozen world, idiot. Hope you fucking like it. Where's the spear at? There we go. Now that's not a completely worthless spear, so... Gotta get my fucking ass up there. Gotta get to that... Gotta get to that trower. Brendan, more accents. Ooh, more iron on you, ladies. More accents, more silly voices, Brendan. Level it up, Brendan. Come on, Brendan. Your contemporaries are literally owning you in the silly voice department. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna chill. I'm gonna vibe. I'm gonna get my red jelly. Make me my red jelly sandwich. What are they gonna do? Fucking go. Oh, why'd I drop that? I was gonna put a, another spring down. Boing! Always worth it. Hi. How's it going? I'm SpongeBob! Where's my, uh, health? Oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. I forgot that I ate, like, I forgot that it's hot outside, so I ate hotted meal. Or anti hotted meal. I guess would be more accurate. Oh well. It's fine. Come here. I'm just gonna clean house. No more lizards. Treat me like the exterminator. He's like the Terminator, but he killed Bug, and he's in every town and city. Oh, you son of a bitch. You want me to walk direct? I'll walk directly into the fire, dude. I'm not afraid to do it. Uh, new spear. There we go. Come here. Gotcha. Get fucked, maybe. Well, they got more guys over here. They got a bevy of guys out here. Great idea. Eat hot foods, you sweat. We love to see it. What are you guys, what are you, what are you guys doing? You're being silly. You're being silly. You guys are being silly. Aw, uh, eating a spicy fucking food, aren't you? We had a spicy fucking pizza. Fall. Can he come all the way back up here? I don't think so. Drop him. Drop him. That guy's dead. Oh no, he's not. Oh shit, he... <laughs> You're silly. Still not dead. That was kind of silly. That was kind of goofy. I find it kind of silly. I find it kind of sad. The things I thought were funny were the best I ever had. Why he lick you? I don't know. They, Lizalfos, dubious be a little freaky with their tunge. Ow. They do be they do be, be a little freaky with a tonge, I just saying it. But I want their free I want all their talons and their horns so I can have a bevy of thingus to make weapon for. I'm really glad that this game elevated monster parts in a way that the other one didn't, whereas monster parts were only for tinctures, elixirs, and potions. 
Now you got a lot of utility with him for weapon creating and weapon crafting, especially if you always want upgraded arrow. Feels good. Dick man. I love seeing Did I make a penis in the game yet, Brendan? No. Do you want me to? Yes. Okay. I can do that. <laughs> I don't want to be anything other than what I've been trying to be lately. Oh, God damn it! Why the fuck are there guys here? Are there cold guys here now? I just killed a bunch of guys. One second. Once well, these fucking guys are going to piss me right the fuck off. Give me just a sec to take care of these sons of bitches. Oh, fucker. I lost all his shit. They're dead. They get stuffed. They get fucked. All right, where's this stake at? We're going to make ourselves a little guy. Let's do it. Let's make a little guy with balls and cock and ear and eye. Oh, damn it. I can't put this. Now it's time for the piece de resistance. What if we made that dick shoot fire, babe? The Neil Jet Armstrong Cannon Armstrong. Burn, baby, burn, burn, baby. Yeah, take a pic take a quick picture with me. Yeah, pretty funny, isn't it? Yeah, I'm a real freak. Yeah. Yeah, I know I'm a real freak. Yeah, I know what I did. And I know what I done. And I know my oh Lord knows what I'm about to do. I know what I did. I know what I done. Lord knows what I'm about to do. I need a hot meal now. Son of a bitch. Oh, dude, am I out of spice? Am I out of peppers? I think I'm out of peppers. Shid. Hi, Shelby. How was your nap? Cook dishes that will... Oh, bitter cold. Don't fuck me. Fuck you. Fuck you. I did wake you up. You said okay. And then I walked away and I said, you're going to get up, right? And you said, yeah, I'm getting up. No, I didn't get up and leave. I distinctly remember telling you, hey, I'm going to get up now. You were like, okay. No, I didn't. How do you remember that? And why didn't you just get out of bed? Did you just slap me because you, you don't have a good response? Yeah, that's right. Oh, no, you should go feed her. I don't know where she is. She might be under the bed still. She might just have a good nap. Is that a weird dog? Oh, no, those are just more lizard guys. Okay. Just more lizard guys. So, they're like, do they swap the... What's this rock? Where do you want this rock? Oh, you want the rock there? Okay.
Rock and hole. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Yeah, I made a cock and balls. What else do you want? Like, I made a katamari. I made a cock and balls. I don't know. I don't know what else to make in the world of Legend of Zelda. Zelda. Who the fuck? Ma'am? Is this fucking Kung Fu Panda? Master! Yeah, I'm sitting here under the cherry. Uh, I'm sitting here under the cherry blossom tree. Yeah, me and my cutie pie love hanging out. Yeah, we love chilling in the desert, in the cold, cold desert under the cherry blossom tree. Because that's like what life is about, dude. It's not about riding scoot. It's not about getting mad gnar off the wave. No, it's about hanging out with your loved ones. And this lady that I just met, brand new wife. Wow. Happy wife, happy life. Zelda who? I'm all about Kenora now. Apparently they want fruit. What kind of fruit do they want? They're little creatures. They love fruit. What? Horse? Horse! Ah, I snee, whores. What did I just do there? Horns, 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 horns. Why did the horns tell me to go there? Is that where caves are? Oh, bro, that's how you find out where caves are. That's why the horns told me to go there. I'd rather cave explore. We're spelunking, babe. The horns told me where to find the cave. Mimi, when I hold, lost in the straws. Got a brand new wife. Got a brand new horse. Call up the lawyer. Get a horse divorce. You can fight me all you want, lizards. I'm going hole exploring. Mimi, see a hole. Mimi, jump inside of hole. Hey guys, what's up? Going off to fight Diabolo. Diab what is it? Diab Diabolos. Going out to fight Diabolos. What this guy be doing? He be chilling by the hole? What's up? Can you help me? I traveled here with my friends and I got cold. I'm so fucking cold. I need a spicy pepper. I don't got a spicy pepper, you little freak. Go get your own spicy pepper. I don't fucking know you. I'm going into the silly cave. Fight me a bubble. Give me your bubble orb. Got me a seven bubble gem. So there are going to be cherry blossom trees everywhere that tell me where these silly little caves are, which is really fucking nice, honestly. I can get many an amber and many a rock salt. Uh, how, uh, I don't know. I just wanted to swap them. I like to be able to lean back sometimes while a video game, and I hate that that one doesn't lean back. So still not a winner, but it's at least not as bad as the other chair we got. I just like to be able to lean back in my chair, you know? I don't like a chair that doesn't lean. I don't like a chair if it's not filled to the brim with lean. Oh, is that a silly guy? Oh god, I hate that shit. Especially with the low amount of, uh... I hate... Mm. God, with the low amount of fucking arrows that I have... Sometimes I hate this shit. There we go. Give me your stuff. 
Give me the black horrible and black horrible and horn and some horrible and guts. Up. Groceries. What kind of groceries do you want to get? You don't know. I want the groceries that are yummy and tasty. Is that easy for you? Uh, fuse this son of a bitch onto my claymore. Oh wait, not the rock. Why? Why did put the rock on there? I didn't even see a rock. Dwayne once again interfering. There we go. Oh, what else did I have? I had this sturdy long stick, which I can put a black cobblin horn on, make a little trident. So where does this go? Just lead out? Grab that lizard. Here, lizard, lizard, lizard. Just not roasting an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at my toes. God, it is fucking freezing. What do I want for groceries? Um, give me some kettle chips and some Mountain Dew. Oh no, Pepsi, Pepsi Zero. Why am I such a kettle, kettle chip bitch? It's because I really like kettle chips. I'm sorry. They're having problems over here. There we go. The bats are deceased. I've killed the bats. The bats are dead. Give me your- Ooh, look at all those eyeballs! Eyeball bowling! Okay, so this leads out over to here. But I don't want to go through here, so I'm going to head back in. Fuck, a horrible idea from here. Horrible idea from here. Better to probably jump up here. Wait a second, and then... Yeah! Flap over here. Alright, I think also there was a little contraption I could make at the beginning of here. I'm a little contraption. I'm the contraption. I'm going to be the ball-busting machine. Real. Should check the stream chat in Discord when you get a second. Oh, let me check it out. Ba -ba -ba. Oh, I, why am I the dud? Uh, <laughs> oh, one sec. I'll share this on stream. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta show off the dud. That's great dud artwork right there is the fucking... Uh. Hey. <laughs> Good bit. Me when I get the dud. Me when I get the dud. I'm so full of nightmares. I'm so full of nightmares. I had a nap earlier, uh, and I really did have a horrible little nightmare about what if, um... What if... Like, I had, you know the, what is it, the the scary stories to tell in the dark? Where they, um, fucked up, and they have the, uh, the girl who has the, um, spider nest in her face. I was thinking, oh fuck, what if that was me? Not a good, not a good, not a good drear. Not a good drear at all. Horrible fucking drear. Brendan Ascension. Brendan Ascension real? Brendan Ascension real. Fly me to the moon. Make me with big boom. Now, only three rockets. I feel like there should be four. Oh, Chepst. That was hiding. Hey, the stupid question, but if your name isn't Daniel, why is your name Bryn Daniel? Uh, no, that's a very smart question, actually. So, when I was in high school, I had a friend named David, and David... Not the, not the David that you may know that I work with sometimes, that is my friend. Um, a different David. This is high school David. And high school David thought it'd be really funny to ask me a question, and he said... Hey, Brandon. He's going to be the voice of Ed from Ed and Nettie in this, in this question, in this scenario. David would say, Hey, Brandon. Why is your name Brendan? Is that like shortened form? 
is, you know how people are named Dan? What if your name was Bryn Daniel? And so I got that nickname from him and I fucking hated it for the longest fucking time. Uh, I even tried to be like, okay, well, uh, the video to like try to come up with some kind of clever retort or a post. And then eventually I started owning it and I was like, fuck it. That's me. What if my full name was Bryn Daniel? That's it. That's the story of how I got my funny internet username. It's not very exciting. Uh, this is a horrible idea, by the way. The platform is on fire. I lit myself on fire like a silly little guy. But it popped me out of the hole. Time to deliver a pizza ball. Food ideas. What are meal ideas? Chat, you can be helpful with this. Me and my wife are looking to eat some scrumptious meals later in the week. Maybe you can help us out. If you have an idea for a scrumptious meal, please let me know in the comments below, and we'll think about doing that scrumptious meal. Big spaghetti meal. We already have meatballs for spaghetti. Uh, tater tot casserole. Fuck that. Shelby didn't like it. I really didn't like it the last time we had it. Last time we tried. So, uh, fuck that. Yumbo slumbo. Shelby, write that down. Write that down. Write that down. Yumbo slumbo. Tilapia with peanut butter sauce. That's fish. I ix that. Nix that. Banana. Oh, I got tricked, didn't I? <laughs> I got banana slammed! I'm so fucking mad. Savor those bananas as you die. No, please don't. I was trying to be a banana boy. No, sir, please don't. You're dead. I got my bananas. He's dead. I'm too hot. Hot darn. It's too freaking hot out here. It is freaking hot. I am freaking burning up, my dude. The outside is arid, and it is fierce with a thousand flames and fires. Oh, this is a silly guy clan base, ain't it? Let's go. Chili with your cinnamon rolls. We haven't had chili in a while. But I don't know how much you want to do, like, chili work. Do meat and potatoes. I like potatoes. You should get some potatoes from some sides. Like a good potato. I'd love a good potato, Shelby. Shelby, I'd love a good potato. Not gonna lie. Love a good potato. You want to do a good potato? I'm thinking about a good potato. Let's do a baked potato for a meal. Let's get some uh, pork chops. We got pork chops? We got pork chops. Get some potatoes. Let's do some uh, baked potatoes, all right? You get a little bit of foil. Get a little bit of butter. Let's do some baked potatoes. I'm thinking baked potatoes. How about you get some uh, baked potatoes on that list there? How about we do loaded baked potatoes? How about some loaded baked potatoes? Nothing crazy. Nothing fancy. A little bit of butter. A little bit of potato. A little bit of chive. You're a loaded potato. I have nothing to say of those of not Yiga. So I gotta, like, get a full outfit, I'm assuming, and then I bet I can come here. I'm vibing with it. I feel it. I feel it. I feel, I feel his energy. His energy is high. Oh, shit! It's a walking tummy man! Hello, Goron. Oh, a flood came and washed the road away. Oh, bro. That fucking sucks, bud. Oh, I feel for you, bud. I do. I feel for you. I feel bad for you, bud. Ooh, that fucking sucks, bud. The river washed the road away. Ganon is trying to give water to the desert. That fucking sucks for you, bud. He's, try he's trying to hydrate the Gerudo. But it's not the Gerudo you gotta worry about, bud. It's everybody else that's thirsty for him. Are you looking at the chat thinking of meal ideas? Do you do popcorn shrimp? You really like popcorn shrimp, so we could just get a bag of it. Did you forget about your hunger for shrimp? Are you immediately putting popcorn shrimp on the list? No. Chili. You're gonna do chili. You still tired, huh? Oh god, I'm on fire. Why isn't there a dedicated stop, drop, and roll button? So disappointed in Nintendo for this. Oh, meal idea, meat car. What we do, Shelby, is we pay thousands of dollars and get a bunch of Omaha steaks using Omaha steak code, Brendaniel. 
And then we slap the meat on the side of your car and then meat car. How's that? She's nodding. She's nodding. She's smiling. She's, she's screaming. She's looking at me with excitement. That is a look of pure jubilation. Pure delight. Meat car. She's, she's not looking at me with jubilation. We all know this, right? We all know she's looking at me like, what the fuck are you talking about, you little freak? Which is fine. I'm your little freak. Oh no, the rock fell, so you have a rewind ability that lets me, like, flip it. The Sky Islands. Do you not see the Sky Islands everywhere? Is that cool? Does your wife watch your stream VODs? No, she's just right here. What? What are you looking at me like? What is your face doing? Don't scritch me. Why? Do you want to play this? Is that what you're getting? No. Of course not. You don't like playing good video games. You like playing TF2 and that's it. Your one game. Oh, this shit busted. Fucking A. Every time. I think you'd like this game. It has the same level of, like, exploration as Slime Rancher. But I have, um, Breath of the Wild if you want to play that, so I don't have to buy it for you. You can just play Breath of the Wild if you want. It's the same type of vibe as this. This is the sequel to that. You won't play with my butt. I will not let you. Oh, is she loafing? Did you feed her? Okay. She's full of food. I'm not saying TF2 is a good video game. Just trying to convince my wife to play any other game other than TF2 is an insane task. Oh, do I gotta get this guy uppies? Do you need uppies, sir? Oh, the tower's out of order, and you're here to fix it, and the elevator is also broken. Sad. Oh. Ah. The platform is gone, and there's nothing to attach to that metal ah. bit. What a shame. What a shame, my dude, what a shame. I can assist. I can do this. Uh, I didn't want to do that. Uh, swap over to spring. What a shame. The poor groom's bride is a... We're Oh, that'll work. Free rock. What did somebody say? Stop that. Don't fucking do that. Ow. God damn it, Shelby. Don't do that. Please. That's my fucking nipple. That shit hurts. Don't do that. Just because the chat tells you to do that doesn't mean you should do that. Yeah, but just don't do it. Maybe, please. Don't purple my nurple. Yeah, please don't. My nurple is already... My nurple is as, 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 as tense as I want it to be. Kind of heavy. Oh, it wanted me to put those boxes on there, didn't it? That's why. I shouldn't have broken those boxes. I wasn't thinking. Stop. You're not helping. You're a nightmare. You are literally a nightmare. I gotta put individual wood logs over here and hope that that's enough to make this, uh... What, what, what am I doing? I just have things that are... Oh, damn it. I didn't mean to do that shit. There we go. I was just like, maybe if I put some fans on it, too? I don't...
It's just not heavy enough. I don't have a big rock on me. Oh god, I gotta make a I gotta make a meal first. I gotta make a chilling meal. Uh fuck. Damn it, I made dubious food. Fuck. I'm gonna make a chilling meal. Oh god. No, it's it doesn't it did when you're hot, you have to have something that stops you from being hot. I have this though. This should help. There we go. No, that's cold resistance. Fuck, I need heat resistance. There we go. Oh shit. I just dropped it because I need to put another fucking pot down. I hate that these are single use. Oh, uh, let's see. Give me give me the beef boy. Give me the nut and the rock salt. There we go, thank goodness. Mm, yummy. Dubious food. Now why doesn't this shit work? How heavy do I have to make this son of a bitch? How oh, is this not man heavy? Nothing's broke up there. This should work, right? Maybe this one's not big enough. Do I have wood? Can I make a cramp fire? Not a big deal. Anyway, uh, should I try to make a big one attached to it? Is that not heavy enough? Hmm. I'm curious how that's not like heavy enough. It's odd. I wonder though if I grab this giganto box. That might be heavy enough for it. I love that this guy refuses to walk normally. Right? Like there is a path that leads all the way up there, and he just refuses to take the path. 
He could literally, oh, well, no, hey, I mean, hey, he could go around, but they got mud lizards over there. Oh, no, these are the ice lizards, aren't they? Oh, they were just, they, oh, that's right. I forgot that, like, the, the lizards, there are two elemental lizards. Pick up? I don't know, three to four, two to three. Come here. Come here. Stop trying to cause problems. We don't like that here. Bye bye. There we go. This big fucking box should be enough. I know I was supposed to use the fucking metal boxes that were over here. This big fucking box should be enough. And there's another big fucking box right over there. Son of a bitch. You see how I did that? How I went all the way around? And if I just looked behind... If I just take it a second. Remember to have patience, kids. If you don't have patience, if, if you're like, Oh, Mom, when do I get my pudding? Uh, you, can you wait an hour, honey? No, I can't. No, no, no. If you're like that, if you're like the pudding child in this scenario, you're fucked. Be, be, be have patience and look. Never mind. This still, this fucking sucks. Oh my god, what did I do? How did I do this? Oh my god, I hate the desert. I hate the desert. I hate the desert. Is that as far as it goes? Why is it only going that far? Oh, that's not as far as it's supposed to go. I, I'm stupid. Never mind. I'm dumb. I really thought I was like, why isn't it going further down? Ah, I'm stupid. Woo! You should get a spring like me, my guy. Hi. Thanks, bro. Uh... Ah. Ah. Oh. Into the sky! Come, Master Link! We're off! It's so chilly in the desert, and this tower is so bulbous! Oh my god, look at the boy. He's so bulbous. There we go. Yay. And we got some thingus in the sky as well. Fog. Why is there a Borg cube? Oh, that's like a dungeon or labyrinth, basically. Easiest way to put it. Oh, so when you find... I wonder if there's a cherry blossom tree in every segment of the map. And then when you find the cherry blossom tree, it shows you where all of the caves are on the map. That's fucking sick! Alright, there's a couple of shrines I want to do that I've seen. Accelerate! Is that a falling star? What the oh, grab it, midair! 
That's a falling star right on top of me. What in the fuck? What in the goddamn? Right on. I've never had that fucking happen. What in the fuck? Right on top of me. That shit almost hit me. <laughs> That's super rare. <laughs> I haven't even seen one in this game yet. I only have one in Breath of the Wild. Jesus. That was fucking weirdly lucky. All right. That'll never happen again in a thousand years. I was really... It would be really funny if it fucking hit me, ragdolled me, and killed me. Imagine being the guy who died to a cosmic peace. What if it fucking popped my head like a gourd? Hidden metal. Nice. I understand. Hidden metal. I see. Complete the chain. I snee, I snee, I snee. I fathom this. Yes. Epic science. Science is fucking awesome. And cool. Hi, guys. My name is Link. Don't you think science is fucking awesome and fucking cool? God, I love electricity. Got it. Oh, shit. Oh, ascend. I have ascend. Go forth, young Link. There we are, young Link. Well done, young Link. Oh, shit. Don't fall, dude. Thanks, young Link. Well done, young Link. I'm proud of you and your progress of your adventure. <laughs> Grab a ball. Okay, so I balled I balled that ball, and that moved some of the gear. What did that ball that ball to? One sec. Let me uh b -b 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 -r recall. Are you Link's dad? Yes. Yes. Well done, son. It's me, your father, Link. Father. Did you bring egg home? How is egg yield, my son? My famous son, Link, adventurer of the world. How is my egg son doing? Hope my egg son is having a happy egg meal. That's exactly what Link's dad says all the time. Hope my happy egg son is having a happy egg meal. Love my egg son. He brings me egg. I love he. One second, I'm fucking smart, watch this. Take that off. What do I have in my brain inventory that can help in a situation like this? I wonder. I can't use Zonai. I can't use Zonai equipment in here. So I have to think smart. And that's how we think smart. Is uh, by cheating. Is Brenventory what you call your pockets, Brendan? Yeah. Oops. 
Damn it. I broke it. Wait, no. Ah, uh, it doesn't work like that. You can't reverse it. Ah, that would have been fucking sick if I could just reverse it. Instead of doing this puzzle like a normal human being, I decided to get a little fucky with it. I cheated. Listen, I don't know why I just love saying Brenventory whenever I talk about my inventory in video games, because my name is Brendan. It's just a little quirk, don't worry about it. I'm just a little quirky, I'm just a little weird. I do be posting on Tumblr.com and saying that all of these soups are far too spicy for me, and I want to talk to the soup witch who made these soups. I have a Tumblr account. What if I post it on my Tumblr account? Let me take a look here. Let me let me check some of my Tumblr posts here, because I, I like I like to text shit posts sometimes. Let me see. What have I posted there? Um, let's see. I think they should make a cool weapon in a video game that's like Luigi's vacuum, but it just sucks the meat right off the enemy so that it leaves only the skeleton, and then the skeleton falls down to the ground with a loud clank and clack. Alright. Out here and hurgling. Out here gurgling and hurgling my best life. Motherfuckers will talk about their little guy or their little scrimblow, and it's just some scrungly little white guy cracking open a pack of Marlboro cigarettes and railing about how the gas station didn't deserve them anyway after getting fired for stealing three white monsters every shift. Let me see. If you were the Incredible Hulk and you had full control of the Hulk, would you just make your cock like an inch bigger just to fuck with your partner mid-coitus? Or would you be worried they'd whip it, that you'd whip it out and they would see it and they'd say, Now why the fuck is it green? Uh, what else have I written on my Tumblr? Such amazing things. The, the, the process of my mind. Fucked up that gas stations exist. Fucked up that gas stations exist, but I asked the city for one oats and grain station for my horses, and everybody loses their minds. Uh, what else have I written on Tumblr? Have I written on Tumblr.com? There's got to be a porn parody of Evil Dead out there with the tagline, Head by Dawn. Uh... Hate that urban fantasy either devolves into fucking and sucking vampires or sticking cybernetic hardware up your dick hole. I want an urban fantasy setting for tabletop that's just, oh fuck, I gotta get to my 6am shift at the Best Buy, but also I'm an orc and fire magic out of my hands, but I gotta sell an iMac and a credit card to a dragon today. Uh, what else? What, what are some other ones? Going lich mode, hiding my soul in a random Funko Pop and putting it into my gamer Funko room so that any passing adventurer will never be able to find it in my wall-to-wall -wall covered vinyl hellhole. Funko Lactory. If I put hot dogs on the Christmas tree and leave meat milk and meat cookies, will I get the meat version of Santa Claus for Christmas this year? Uh, fucked up that there's popcorn shrimp and popcorn chicken, but no popcorn beef or popcorn turkey or popcorn snake. I think the popcorn one is really good. It is fucked up that there's only, like, popcorn chicken and popcorn shrimp. Nobody popcorns beef. Nobody popcorns turkey. Even, like, fried beef is just called chicken fried steak. Yeah, even fried fried beef is just called chicken fried steak. It's not popcorn beef. Why isn't it popcorn beef? Why can't you beef your popcorn and popcorn your beef? Someone immediately says, I shouldn't have come here. Never should have come here. Worst Man Online Award, 2023. Why isn't there popcorn beef? Haha, ha, Brendan, I found a recipe called Popcorn Steak Bites. There's going to be a recipe for fucking everything. You could look up peanut butter buttered cock. Don't look that up, by the way. Don't look Don't look that up. That's going to be something, some, something way fucking different. You could look up literally anything. How do you popcorn beef? It's, it's just 
cubes of meat and you batter it and you bread it. There's a recipe for fucking everything now. You can find a recipe for fucking NyQuil chicken. You can find a recipe for anything. Mama's making another batch of her famous NyQuil chicken. Here I am once again. I'm falling to pieces. Love how it just shoot you up. Pretty good cube. I don't think there's a Skyland like around me that I could easily get to. But I can go over there. To the shrine-ish. Oh, fuck. It's fucking cold out, isn't it? I don't think I have any hotted foods. Do I? Cold resistance. There we go. Hotted food ahead! Would sell it, though. KFC just can't start selling batter, batter, batter fried beef. Culver's. I don't know. Something fucking weird. Like an Americana restaurant. Wendy's. Wendy's. Wendy's could sell popcorn beef. Genuinely believe that Wendy's could sell popcorn beef to the average consumer. Oh, this is a stable. Fog. Gerudo Canyon stable. What the hell? Boxes! Everywhere! Will I ever clean all this up? Dude, I'm helping you right now. This is the best mission ever. Marie Kondo, this son of a bitch's orb. Marie Kondo for this son of a bitch. We're helping this dude out. And we're getting arrows for it. I call this a fucking win-win. Will, will I ever get rid of all these boxes? Dude, I am here to help. I fucking love cleaning. Thank you, Peter Sucks, for the small, luxurious meal. Love me my popcorn beef. <laughs> <laughs> My funny hammer broke. Did I get it all? I cleaned up your area? Did I assist you? Oh, um, good job making it in here. You're up and about awfully early. I mean, it's impressive that you came all this way, but the stable has closed its doors for good. It's thanks to this extreme weather, almost no one rides through here. We get very few visitors of any sort. Making things worse, Princess Zelda gave the order that everyone had to stay away from our well. But we need the water, not to mention the mushrooms that grow inside of it. It's only temporary. It'll help, she said. I'll be right back to fix it, she said. And then she completely abandoned us. Oh, sorry about that. The sadness just gets to me sometimes. Why is Piafi the most relatable Zelda character I've ever fucking seen? The sadness just gets to me sometimes. Dude, I fucking agree. Yeah, cleaned. You're welcome. I helped. I got a pony point. I don't know what the pony point do, but I get a reward for the pony point. Oh, funny frames. What are these? Property of the Stable Association. Do not touch. They're just frames. They're just picture frames. Aw. So sad. I hate that this is the final days of the stable. I don't want it to be that way. I want to save the stable. How do I save the stable? I want to be a happy helper. I want to be a good guy. Oh, it whips. That's good. With those spicy pepper. Princess Zelda said to stay away from our well. Okay, Princess Zelda. Why did you want them to stay away from their well? Well, well, well. What have we here, Zelda? Oh, I see. This bitch locked up some nightmares in here. We 
are my blue bacoblin horns. These are good for arrows. Oh, shit. Son of a bitch. What a horrible little place to fight in with all the water out there. Also, these guys toughy. Those guys strong. Those guys fucking scary toughy. Do you get my analogy that T Tears of the King is just one long Lisa Simpsons hit and run level? No, I don't get it. Just drown them? You can't drown the lizards. The lizards don't drown is the fucked up thing. Oh fuck, dead in one hit though. Oh my god, penis and suck. Oh shit. At least the purple guy die pretty easily. Oh my fucking god, I hate the tunge. Brendan, really be using a bow out here in close combat. I'm trying my best. You gotta be freaking mean to me. I'm trying to freaking hit them in their freaking head. Because then if I hit them in their freaking head, they fall down, make big boom. And then I laugh at them. I go, <laughs> how silly. How droll. Princess Zelda said not to go in our well. All right, we'll try this again. Van has to yet, Brendan? I have not. I'll find him eventually. Let's see. Nice to meet you. I don't care if that also hit me. It was worth it. Do not care if it also hit me. Totally worth it. Uh, drop. Woo! 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 Every time I pick up an item in this game, I'm just gonna... Yeah, ha, ha you son of a bitch. Let's see here. Uh, follow me, set me free, trust me, and we will escape from the city. <laughs> what a really strong Rusty Claymore. How good is that one? 32, jeez. Put that on the boomerang. Can you really call this a boomerang? Is it still bo Oh, I fucked up. I didn't know that didn't do shit. Don't attack me, please, sir. Does this still boom and rang? Oh, it does still boom and rang. Even though it looks like it looks like a fucking katana now with a hilt and everything. It still booms and rangs. Oh, that's good. That's good shit. I don't like it. All right, uh, how do I deal with this son of a bitch? Let's see. First up, we're going to come over here. Drop our shit bow. Come over here, get the good bow. Where is 
little bit of ice. What is this? Oh, that's like the power of water. I have shock fruit, though. That works. And if I put a... Big things on here. Fuck you, worm. Another worm defeated. Another worm for the wormhole, eh, Brendan? You know what? A Druto Smith Scimitar might be the best. I want to try those the Lizalfos tail. Because, oh shit. I. So not great for, all right, so not great for very specific things, but really great for high damage. 56. I can hear him under, oh shit, a hearty truffle. Who fucking wanted a truffle? Shit. Oh God, I needed to get somebody a truffle. Somebody needed a truffle. Fuck. Who needed a truffle? The innkeeper in Kakariko Village needed a truffle. I remembered. Holy shit. Holy shit. How did my brain fucking remember that? Oh my god. The innkeeper in Kakariko Village needs uh needs a truffle. Alright, we're good. We know where that is. I remembered. Huge brain! Fill my brain up with Spain. Spain facts. Do not laugh at me, ha ha. Alright, so we gotta go back to Kakariko Village and give a man I gotta talk to a man about a fish. Uh talk to a man about a hearty truffle. All right, um, seepy man. Where's the seepy man then? Seepy man. We gotta go talk to the seepy man. Man be seepy. We'll come back this way. After we deal with the seepy man, man seepy, he want he truffle. He wants to sniff and snorf his fucking truffle. And I know where he is. And I know where he is, and I know where he is, and I know where he is. You can tell everybody, I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. Well, you can tell everybody. He's up there. You son of a bitch, you fuck of a man. I know where you are. He's up there. He's seeping. I'm going to wake him up with a hearty truffle. Then that son of a bitch better fucking let me sleep in a bed in Kakariko Village. I also gotta go to Hatano Village because I finally have something... Something that can, like, get rid of the gloom, maybe? Uh, and I need to make porridge for the grandma, so... I want to be able to, like, afford the luchador outfit, please, so... Gotta be out here paying attention to my queezs. And I need milk, and I have- I can get rice pretty easily, but I need milk. What do I do? Just pick it up? And drop it. Okay. He's awake! Snorf- he's snorfing! And I get to keep the truffle. Ah. Mm. Mm. I snorfle and snuffle with the big boy hearty truffle. Uh, back to the town because I want to go to the inn to be able to seep in the bed there. I need milk. Where is, uh, Hateno Village at? I gotta find it. Hi. 
I'll, you know what? I'll take one. Give me a garland. Mine. Well, I guess I just have this forever. What do I, what do I do with this? Does somebody want this? I don't. You know, when I gather around at Christmas time, I'm thankful for my family. But the one thing I'm definitely thankful for is my favorite treat for a family guy like me. Oh. Love me my meat garland. Doesn't everybody love a meat, like a good meat garland for the holidays, you know? For the holidays, you know. There we go. I think this is a good safe place for our meat garland. Hmm. What a good what a good meat garland. What a powerful thing, Gus. What a powerful meat garden. I'm the sleepy one here. Hey, I helped you. Milk? You got milk? Sticky elixir! Why do you, well, I helped a man get a bed and he gave me a sticky elixir. I don't trust anybody who hands me a, like a goopy ass concoction. Okay, fucking. Okay, dude. Okay, guy. Okay, dude. Okay, guy. Okay, dude. All right. Where is Hateno Village at? Because that's kind of where I actually want to go next. Laurelin Village is over here. You already marked it in blue? Oh! That's where it is? I marked a tower. I didn't mark Hitana Village, but I I guess that'll do. Come on, tower boy! Get to fucking flying! Come on, tower boy, why don't you go and, I don't know, climb some freaking towers? Okay, okay. Okay, fine, dude, fine. I'll freaking climb some freaking towers, dude. Fine. Don't be so bashful about it, tower boy. Climb those fucking towers. Okay, dude, okay, fine, dude, okay, okay, dude, fine. Ah, oh, fuck, I fell for it. He's gone. I lost him. Right, let's go blue tower, blue hole, blue tower. I'm sick of being in the fucking desert. It's got all those fucking... Being in the desert is nice and all, but it's got all those fucking problems with heat and cold. Biffed off. Blast off into the sky. God, this game would be a lot better if it had a fucking kick-ass Randy Newman soundtrack. Love me, my orb. Love me, my sky. Love me, my finding a fighting freaking guy. Love me, my orb. Love me, my guy. Love me, a flying round the mother freaking sky. I'm gonna stop at the orbule here. I don't think I've been here, have I? No, I have definitely been here. I have been here. I completed the shrine here. Yep, no, I have definitely been here. I remember now. I remember. I recall. I see a gazpacho machine, though. I need this. Atena Village is in the same place it was in Breath of the Wild. Yeah, but do you think I remember where that is? Like, come on. You don't gotta be mean about it. It's not like the whole town is gonna walk away. You don't have to talk like Gary Oak out here. You don't gotta, you don't gotta like, try to Gary Oak me. Like, sorry, rival! You know exactly where it should be. Yeah, I, I do. I, I know. Shut up. Jeez. Grosh. Ah, this is good, actually. Okay. 
fire me. Number one, we stop here at the rock mountain. Yes, we find many rock here. It's very exciting. Sage's will! What the hell is a sage's will? I used to work with somebody at GameStop named Sage. What the hell is the Sage's Will? Oh, I get a lot of Luminous Stone. Ooh, Shiny Rock. So Sage-pilled right now. Literally filled to the brim with knowledge! Give me my luminous stone. Thank you for the cool rock. Thank you for cool rocks. And thanks to uh, coolrock.com for sponsoring this stream. Got a wish. Oh, fuck. It's going to be crawled there, isn't it? Oh, this is going to be a trial, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that crown. I can already see the fucking ice everywhere. That crown's gonna be a pain in- that- the tower? Not crown. That tower, it looks kind of like a crown. That tower's gonna be a pain in my cock. That is a penis tower through and through. Fucking A. Where's the fucking village at? There's the village, at least. We can go there first. Now this should be looking like some Xenoblade Chronicles shit out here. Ow. I lived. I shouldn't have, but I lived. Was that a big guy with a big, large, jiggling belly? Always leading a pack of boys? I could fight them. Save. Can't carry any more shields. Stop that. Meat. Hit you with egg arrow. Got him. Egg arrow always works. I have a bunch of... I'll get more of these from fighting you. God, I gotta make more meal. Why did he drop so many meats? Oh, they were carrying meat. They were capturing meat. Where did you guys get the bees from? Oh, God, Jesus Christ. Where'd that prime beef come? Oh, jeez. I'm having a little bit of trouble here. Ooh, having a little bit of fucking trouble here, bud. Oh my god, penis weenus. Stop that, you son of a bitch. Fucking dickhead. Got him. That was just Mr. Big Boy left. Hello, Mr. Big Boy. Get fucked. Get fucked, Mr. Big Boy. Don't fuck with me. Give me all your fangs. Give me all your loot. Give me all your shit. I need all your fucking little bits, little bobs. Give them all to me. Hand them all the fuck over. Give me your... Oh, rice! I do need some of that famous Hylian rice so I can make some famous jelly-filled donuts. I just love a jelly-filled donut.
And crickets. I need bugs. Always need more bugs. Alright, Hateno Village is over here. I see it. Try to hide from me, you son of a bitch, but I know who you are and I know where you are. I love that you get rice just from, like, sweeping the ground. Everywhere. This, this whole world is a rice field. Did you know that the entire the, the entirety of the world, and I mean, I mean the whole world, may in fact be a vampire set to Trey a Yane? Kinda of fucked up, kinda of insane. Mowing my lawn with a sword, real. <laughs> this is my best video, dude. I just mowed my lawn with a fucking sword. I just sweeped my sword outside for like three hours. Mowing my lawn by hand, picking every blade of grass individually, real. Eating my lawn like a goat, one bit at a time. Look at this lush field. Look at this dude. Lush field, verdant grass, a bevy. What? What? Giant moth? Okay, that sucks. Are you scared? It's a moth. Do you want me to come and get the giant moth? Is that why you is that why you yelled? I'll come get the giant moth, all right? I'll be back. My wife needs me to go get a giant moth, so Chill for a minute here uh, while I go get the giant moth and another thing to drink. I'm going to play some, uh, I don't know, like... <laughs> God, I'm right, Demasi. What's up, everybody? It's me. Huge moth. Brendan's dead. I got him. <laughs> Just kidding. It's me, Brendan. I was, I, was, I was kidding. I was joking you. I was joshing you. The moth did not get me. Uh, the moth was just gone. I got up there and the uh, the moth had decided to fuck off the second I get up there, so I couldn't get it. Joby had a way scarier scare earlier with a bug. There was a house centipede that was fucking massive. And it crawled out from under the toilet bowl while she was going to the bathroom. And I was just sitting there watching, I don't know, some cartoon. And Shelby just screams, ah! like a Like cartoonish, like, like a really quick and short yell. And I, I saw that fucking thing. And that thing was too scary even for me to get. So I fucking tried to like poke it with a stick. I tried to grab it with tissue paper and it fucking ran away. Eventually, I just, I like summoned my courage because I hate fucking bugs. I despise bugs. Um, walked in there and then just went, all right, shoo. Shoo. I really, I really got to remember that when like you have a bug problem, when you see bug, you just got to grab shoe, grab shoe, get shoe and just shoo that son of a bitch. Not like the nice and kind like shoo, shoo, get out of here. No, like shoe, like that thing, that thing, that thing, that son of a bitch is coming down. Shoe. I need milk. I need milk so I can buy armor, buddy. Oh, fashion. Oh, that's right. I forgot that Hateno Village is like fashion central now, isn't it? Oh my god, everybody dressed up in- Oh my fucking god! Everybody in Hateno Village is a fucking shroom head! What in the god damn? Why is everybody in Hateno Village a fucking mushroom head? They're all penis shaped. This went from Hateno Village to Penis Village. Welcome to Cock Village. Enjoy your stay. Kakariko Village? No, Hateno Village. Everybody here shaped like a cock or a penis. Literally Smurf style. They are out here shaped like fucking mushroom. Literally Smurf style. I love the part where you have to buy the house. Are you fucking kidding me? You gotta buy the house again? Oh my, what a fucking, what, a, what an elaborate, elaborate. Metaphor for capitalism. 
Your home's fucking gone, dude. Gotta buy it again. Pay up, dipshit. Fuck, I don't know why I said metaphor for capitalism and I was thinking about... I, I was watching OKKO OK earlier and I forgot that they made an episode that, like, was trying to talk about gun violence. And, like, one, of course... I don't like guns. Whatever. Doesn't matter. I don't want to talk about fucking... Uh, you love gun, you hate gun. I don't give a shit. I just thought it was really fucking wild that they did an episode that was trying to be like... It, it informed kids on gun violence, but they did it in the weirdest fucking way. To where after I watched the episode, I was like, this is about gun violence? Like, I got it. But it was really confusing at first. It was like a, a guy, a flim flam man came to their town and sold everybody a skeleton remote and the skeleton remote permanently skeletonized people. And then KO woke up and told his mom and then he called his congresswoman and then the congresswoman denied the patent of the, like the skeleton remote. I, which like I watched it till the end and I was like. Was that about gun control? And I'm still thinking about, like... I get them trying to do something, but it was very weird. Should have just been a flim flam man literally just selling guns to people. Like, here's a gun, and here's a gun. This is a really weird fucking episode to think about. Like, I get, I get it. Especially as an American, I get wanting to, like, inform kids about, hey, you're gonna need a bulletproof thing in your backpack because people love guns more than children's lives. Uh, but, like, what a weird fucking way to go about it. They did, a, they did the same thing with, like, a, a, a environmental one as well. Oh, my God. Squid Games. They did one with, like, uh, it was like an environmental episode, but they literally just got Captain Planet. And then Captain Planet's, like, at the end of the episode, he's like, Yeah, world's actually pretty fucked up, KO, and there's nothing we can do about it. But there's something you could do about it. Use less water and use the right light bulbs. I was like, cool. Ah, oh, I get it. You want me to conduct balls, electricity? Balls, balls. What would you do with a skeleton gun? Like a skeletonizer? I don't know if I'd do anything important or cool with it. I don't know. Personally, I don't know if I'd do anything weird or cool with it. So what does this do? This activates the machine. Any last groceries? Mm, not off the top of my head, no. Oh, uh... Pop-Tarts. No, breakfast drink. My breakfast drink. Give me a breakfast drink. Don't forget my breakfast drinks. Uh, pick pick any of them. I don't care. If there's a cinnamon toast crunch one, I want that one. I almost forgot about my breakfast drink. I know I'm going to get a... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Oh, I gotta bring the big Orbis up here. I see. Okay, I get it.
Let me see. If I can do this the right way here. Oh, you know what? If I just attach the ball directly to it. I attached the ball directly to it earlier. I forgot. Literally didn't matter. Okay, there, there, there's there's got to be a chest at the bottom of this, though, right? Yeah, there is a chest at the bottom of the... I thought so. I thought so. You can't hide that shit from me in the orb pit. I thought so. Fucking Brendan stuck in the ball pit. Goddamn Zelda Khan, son of a bitch. Do 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 do. I can't use that. Yeah, I can't do anything with that. Never mind. I don't care. I'll leave it. Today I found that the Violent J of ICP owns a really high quality fursuit and attends conventions with his daughter. Yeah, he's really supportive of his daughter, which like... ICP has done some really fucking awful things, but sometimes they're really weirdly, like, wholesome. That's, I think, to say about any Juggalo or Juggalette is... Being a Juggalo, you can meet some really nasty Juggalos, but you can meet some really nasty Juggalos who are also weirdly wholesome. No matter what, though, they got to be a little nasty and a little freaky. Being nasty and freaky, though, is kind of part of the whole Juggalo lifestyle, so I don't blame them. Ba, 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 ba. God, when you're full of Fago like a Juggalo is, you're going to be freaking phased out. Have they done anything actually bad? I thought ICP were just harmless weirdos that got called an organized crime group for some reason. It really depends. Because, it, like, I used to have neighbors when I was a kid that were all, like, it was basically a family of Juggalos and their grandma. And so it was three kids, the dad, the dad's friend, and it was his kids and his, like, roommate, uh, who was also some weird skeevy guy that lived across from me and my mom, like, our, our first apartment, I guess. Me, my mom, my brother, then eventually my stepdad, my ex-stepdad, and my sister, all living in, like, this apartment at way, like, across from Juggalos. And they were okay most of the time, but their house was filled with roaches. And my brother was way better friends with him. Uh, I would sometimes go over there and hang out a little bit. That's where I played World of Warcraft for the first time and realized I hate MMOs. Um, but I do also have a, a core memory. Two core memories about the Juggalo house. Number one, the dad was really obsessed with HD DVD. He thought it would be the next thing. Uh, then he got a PS3 and was really into Blu-ray. And Blu-ray was the next thing. But he had HD DVD and a copy of King Kong. Peter Jackson's King Kong. Second thing I remember about this house... Uh, the dad had a bunch of vintage 80s skunk furry porn in the basement. And I'm talking like some rank and raw shit. But it was all skunk, like Pepe Le Pew huge cums furry porn in the basement. Like, whoo! I was like a freshman in high school. Oh, what's up? What's wrong? Ah. Ah. 
Nothing you see is on sale. It's all exhibition. What the fuck? Oh, she doesn't even have any clothes. I don't see any clothes in here. Except for, like, mushroom lamps. Are you CC? No. Mushroom hat, mushroom lamp. Smash. Hundred percent smash. No. If I wasn't married, I'd let this woman ruin my life. Hundred percent, no problem. I would absolutely let her ruin my life. No. <laughs> the CC hat, dude. I love the mushroom. Moth got out of the curtains and Bubby is going nuts. This is insane. Get him, Bubby! <laughs> Only the impro most impressive fashionista in Hyrule's trendiest village is worthy of such a crown. Oh, I gotta wear a really fucking fancy outfit for the hat, don't I? Hey, what's all this? Hyrule's trendiest village. I don't remember approving any new slogans for Hateno. Oh, the mayor is angry. The mayor is pissed off. This guy doesn't like the sound of progress. He hears the marching bells and thinks that they're the drum of death, when in actuality, they're the drum of wealth, happiness, and living off the fat of the land in a way that a village has never done it before. What a fucking idiot. This mayor be like, get off your cell phone, and I'd be like, I'm on my fucking cell phone, going like, beep, and then, ah. and then pop. Me on my cell phone be like, You can't stop me. I'm on my favorite app right now. I have so many fucking games on my phone, old man. What are you gonna do, old man? Oh, fuck. An election? Eight Reed supporters. Give them a sample of mushroom. I'm handing out mushroom. Are you Team CC or Team Reed? Uh, oh. uh. It's about CC. Lately, she's been sneaking off in the middle of the night. I don't think it's anything sinister, but the election is soon. I don't want any last minute prizes. I would like you to tail my sister and tell me where she's going. Oh shit. Okay. Is she evil? Oh shit, she might be evil. No, don't make Cece evil. I like her hat. All right, I gotta wait till nighttime. I better make a little fire or find a little fire. I wonder if she is evil. I wonder if she's trying to turn the town into nightmares. Okay, uh, Cece's secret. All right, we're gonna be stealthy as fuck when we do this though. Stealth-a-rama! Alright, we have our funny little stealth mask on, so that's good. 
Um, do I have a stealth meal? I have at least one stealth meal. My stealth is up by one pip, so... Not the worst thing that can happen, but I might make another um, another couple of stealth meal. Just to snee. Let's see if we can find the inn. Inn's up here. Got it. Make me a delicious stealth meal. I'm mighty hungry. Need me one of those stealthy snails. Oh boy. I'm a hungry little guy. I'm a hungry little creature. Me? I just love fighting. Dealing drugs. Why did I say dealing drugs? What's wrong with me? What is what is Link? What's wrong with you? Link, what are you talking about? I just love fighting, dealing drugs, smoking big weeds. Link, what the fuck is up, dude? This is not you, Link. This ain't you. <laughs> it's me now, dude. What in the goddamn? Legend of the Plug. Did you say Legend of the Plug? Wait a minute, wait a minute, did you see? <laughs> That's the funny legend of the fucking plug. That's the funniest. <laughs> oh, that's so, that's. That's just the funny <laughs> legend of the plug. I fucking. Hit him with the Ghetto Smosh reference. I... <laughs> I... <laughs> I fucking love video game rap, dude. It's one of my favorite fucking little weird goddamn parts of the internet. No, that was Ghetto Smosh. Not Smosh. Get... <laughs> Listen, you can go and educate yourself on, on Ghetto Smosh. I'm not here to educate you on it. I don't think I have anything. I don't think I have any other stealthy meals I can make. I would like a seep. I had no idea Wharton could be so stubborn. He'd always humor me before. Would it be so simple for him to wear a CC brand hat? Why is he so against it? Well, maybe he's against it because maybe CC's evil. I'd like to seep, please. Seep until nighttime. I want a restoring extra, extra soft bed. Love my big soft bed. Wait until nighttime. Follow Cece. She would see she 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 sells seashells down by the seashore. Cece, what she's up to? Fuck, dude. Why is it so hard for me sometimes? I can do video game raps super fucking easy. What about Tears of the Kingdom? Pff, I got you. Get my rupee and my battle axe making weapon with fusion. That's the facts. My name is Link, and I love to slay silly monsters every freaking day. Ganon has a huge cock. It's throbbing like a flesh rock. See, I can do it any, any fucking time. I can be a game rapper. It'd get way too sexual, though. I'd make it really weird. I'd just make it really... I don't know why, but anytime I start rapping about video games, I just make it really weird. There's CC at. It's nighttime. Follow Cece at nighttime and see what she's up to. What time do shops close? Is she attacking the moth still? Bless her. Okay, I think it's clearly nighttime now, so we gotta see where she goes off to. We're being a silly little rooftop guy. We're gonna play this Assassin's Creed style. There she is. There she is. What is she doing?
Wait a minute, where the fuck did she go? Oh, she's in there. What is she doing in here? Ah, so she's not evil. She's just eating yummy food. She's having a nice outside round... She's having a round meal. She's not even, like, evil. Just eating food. Ooh, thank you for the 10 iron shrooms. I can't understand why they can't just get along. Okay, we should go find Mayor Reed, because I bet he has a quest for me. Love's fire burns forever! What's up, dude? You can tell me weirdly handsome, dude. I am incredibly handsome. You're welcome. I'm very handsome. You're, look you're, look you're looking very Gretel. I can't wait to hide you in my little candy house and put you in a big oven. Huh? Uh. Ah, Manny's beloved. We love Manny. Manny is so beloved. Where the mayor house at? Why are you looking like banana ninjas? Me, I sliced a fruit when I see it. I'm just like fruit ninja. Ah, uh, here we are. Mayor house. What's on your mind? Read the man of mine. He shuts himself up in our shed every night. I don't know what the faintest idea he's up to. There we go. We gotta get into this man's shed. Never get into a man's shed, they say. I could get into this man's shed. Do I have wood? Oh, let's drop some wood real quick. Make me a little cramp fire. Break into this man's silly little house. And I bet he... Uh, noon? Noon is about midday? I bet he is hiding mushroom in the shed and looking at them and going... <laughs> He's poking them and saying, how bulbous, how bulbous, how girthy, how girthy. Frog. Frog man. Fill me frog up with your hand. Rock. Slime. Rock. Bomb. Frog. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Uh. 
Oh, that's a big boy. Don't touch me, big boy. God damn. They got all these kinds of slimes at the bottom of Hoteno Village. Jeez. In this tiny hole here, is this the... They got the little guy in here. At... Bat. Bat. Too many bat! I get their eyeballs, though. Their eyeballs are really good for, uh, arrows. Speaking of arrows, I also gotta go to the fucking arrow store and buy arrow as well. Let me see if we can grab that chest. Nope, don't fall, Link. Come on, Link. Get up, little buddy. Come on, little buddy. If Link had a YouTube channel, it'd definitely be stuff like that. Oh, like the shitty primitive survival world where it's like, today I'm going to be digging a luxurious pit. It's a really good pit. Don't mind me. Love me my pit. And then the dude builds his little pit and he's like, wow, what a great little pit. Follow and like for more pit videos. And then people follow him because they think he's like all about the armpit, but he's not. And then he posts an apology video where he's really fucking mad. He's like, guys, it needs to stop. Pit exploration is not an armpit, like, it's not an armpit sex show. This needs to fucking stop, guys. Please. I fucked up. I fucked that up in the most wondrous of ways, I'm not gonna lie. That'll do. That's fine. I could have just swam across, but I really wanted to give it a chance. Oh, the frogs already know I'm here. Shit. Frog acquired. Frog acquired. Survival cooking. I love putting thing on stick and then roasting stick and stick delicious. And then I go, fuck yeah, I love me eat stick. I think that's a lot of, I think, that, God. I think a lot of those, like, survival videos, it's, it's, it's really insane that it started off with, like, one dude doing it and then a bunch of people fucking fake doing it. And it's really fucking sad that you're like, oh, I own a little acreage near my home. I better fucking be a fake primitive man instead. Let me, uh, today I'm making a big pit to hold all my meals in and then immediately going home and be like, yep, I'm hungry. Make me lasagna, wife. You're not even going to go, you're going to forage nuts and berries and you're not even going to go out all the way out of your way to like eat them every day. You're fucked up. Please, wife, make me some porridge. I'm sick of living this horrible luxury life. This fake world that I am ensconced in, I am sick of it. Hello, silly guy. Oh, they're making monkey noises. <laughs> heard he butt, huh? You heard your butt. <laughs> heard he butt, didn't he? Heard he butt a little bit, didn't he? Oh, what a sad little guy. What up here? Oh, just some orb and a little bit of meat. Love more arrows. How fucking long these cave be? Red Daniel Memorial Hospital. Why do you post that every time? I'm never going to get it. I don't understand it. You're trying way too hard. I know I'm the man. Listen, I should know. If I know one thing, it's about trying way too hard. From Daniel Memorial Hospital. It's just a... It's so funny to me. Why? Got him. Dead. 
drop me my big chest. Yes. Yes. Ooh, durability up, Thog. There we go, Rock Blade. All right, we got a bunch of little rocks. Let's get this one too. I know I, this, I, like a rock on the end of this is kind of wasted, but I'm going to be honest with you and I'm going to be real. Um, better than at least it's got durability up, so. And I don't really like the eightfold blades. This is just rock on a stick. And I think it's better that way. I think it's happier that way. Break every rock. Every rock has immense, like immense rock potential. Every rock could have an opal. Oh, a little hole. Oh, these caves are fucking vast. Oh, this is the boat hole. Oh shit, I didn't even realize. I know where I am. Ren, would you start popping, popping pimples on stream? Fuck no. Ew, dude. Ah. That's fucking gross. Ucky. That's like finding a wet sock in your mouth at the end of the night, wondering how the fuck it got there. But you know what? You're not worried about it anymore. It's your wet sock. It's part of your identity now. But also, ugh. Yucky, ucky, ucky, yucky, ucky. I was going to ask you about why you are being silly about that rock fuse, then you acknowledged being silly about it, thus making me have no leg to stand on. I literally took your legs away. This is so fucked up. I'm so sorry. Urgh, that's the sound a thwomp make. Brendan Memorial Squished Flat Society. Brendan Memorial Hospital for squished people who get squished flat, especially by rock. Thank you for the small, luxurious meal, Corgi Fist. Let me uh, redeem that real quick with a... <clears throat> <clears throat> Mm -mm, good. So I might do that in order, like a. Mm -mm, good. Love me a couple of those little weenies. Oh man, those things make me lose my mind. Thanks for the little weenies. Yeah, I don't like the eightfold blade though. I just don't like it. it. Like it's got wind and it can knock down bokoblins, so it, it's nice to have sometimes. I just don't like it overall. Brandon, would you watch videos of drain pipes getting cleaned? Nah. I've watched. Uh, I watch. Uh, Every once in a while, I'll, I'll watch, like, wasp nest destruction videos. That's my poison. You know that's my poison. That's, like, it, though. That and lately, like, sometimes when some, like... You know what, like, the Try Guys or, like, Good Mythical Morning reviews, like, random food things? I get really millennial sometimes, and I'm like, I gotta go watch it. I gotta go watch my millennial feed. I gotta go watch my millennial shit. I gotta go watch this guy eat every menu item on the menu. Okay, I'm gonna watch a three-hour video of somebody eating every fucking menu item at the Golden Corral and trying it at least once. All right, this is fucking awesome. And I'm like, ooh, talk about the fries. Talk about the fries. Yes. Yes. Okay. How are the chicken patties? How are the chicken patties? How are the chicken patties? Yes. 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 Like, I literally sometimes get, like, so hyper fixated on videos where somebody just reviews the entire menu of a restaurant. And it's literally just, hey, guys, I'm eating every food that they got today. And then saying a funny little thing after I eat all the food at this place. Epic. And then they eat all the food at the place, and I'm sitting there making a fucking soy face going, Pog, 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 now try the grits. Okay, dude, fucking awesome. But maybe, uh, dude, ooh, you know what you should try? Ooh, 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 try the ham. How's the ham? What level of ham is the ham? Ooh, that's an 8 out of 10 on the hamometer. The hamometer is going wild. Ooh, that's a good ham. Okay, but the prized videos of every item on the menu are, are good. Oh, I haven't seen prized videos yet. I haven't watched anything from Praz since he did, like, a Mountain Dew review and titled it Mountain Dew review. So now I have beef with Praz. Not, like, real beef, but, like, fake internet beef. You trying to make a Mountain Dew review? Really? 
Okay, this is where the shed is, so we have to go... Put a... Red marker there. And then we put a little fire there. And then we... Oh, thank you for the farming hoe. Uh, I don't know why I said that like a subscription. Like, hey, thank you, Farming Ho, for the tier one sub. Appreciate ya. Use the streamer voice on that shit. Oh, the red moon rised. The Shut up, Zelda. Grow up. Stop bitching about the red stained moon. Wouldn't it be funny if I found the exact place where Zelda pops up in those? All right, I gotta figure out exactly where that is now. Oh, all the creatures respawned in the shid. Give me your jelly. You, give me your jelly. Hand over your jelly and nobody gets hurt. Right about here. A little bit further, a little bit further. Too far, too far. He's got a diary in here. Dear diary, I firmly believe that Hateno Village's charm is that it's delicious vegetables and milk from our farms. But there's no denying that these things just aren't resonating with the youth nowadays. And I've got no business being mere if I can't fix that. So I got together with Knack, the best farmer in these parts, and we came up with a new type of pumpkin. The color, shape, and appearance are based on the CC brand aesthetic, which is popular with the young folk. We've hit a snag, though. It might be a bit before we can achieve our goal of shipping the pumpkins out. Ah, uh, so he... I get this dude. He wasn't hiding anything from his wife. The only thing he was hiding was a delicious pumpkin. Me and my friend Knack on the PS2, baby. We're trying to make a new type of pumpkin. I still kind of want Cece to win the mayoral election, but uh, I do want to go talk to his wife about this. God, where's his wife at? Is she working? Oh, no, there's just this whole other part of the village. I've been working at the wife factory all the live long day. I've been working at the wife factory just to pass the time away. That's a cool fucking horse. Hi. Ten tomatoes. Okay, so we beat the submissions. We beat the two submissions. Now we have to talk to Reed. Wherever he is. Miss Zelda. We gotta go and find where Reed is. And then hopefully he'll... Be able to give us our own quest to vote for him for mayor. And then I'm assuming that we can make them maybe co-mayor? I don't know. Maybe. All right, is the mayor going to be in the mayor house doing mayor paperwork? Is that what mayors do? Mr. Mayor! No, he's not in here, is he? No, there he is. Mr. Mayor. 
I'd love to assist you and Cece. The gooey mouthfeel of the one bite my grandfather shared with me. He's trying to make an ooey gooey meal for everybody. <laughs> yeah. Need me my pungent meal. But what about your pumpkin? Oh shit, I should buy milk, huh? Where's the general store at? Bro, I need my fresh milk. Oh, I should also check the clothing store reel. Oh, no, that's that's already Cece's place. We don't care about that. Um, Let's go to the general store. Let's check it all out. Need your moo, moo milk. Give me all your milk. Oh. Hand it over. Oh. 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 Take them all. All your milk. Every bit of milk. And also all your rice. I want all your rice, too. Give me all your rice. Whoa. I gotta make a grandma porridge. Come on me. Making porridge for my meemaw. And what is the recipe for porridge? We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Uh, we're done. We're not gonna worry about Hateno Village right now. I did kind of what I wanted to at least get started there. I got some quests started. We're gonna go back to Kakariko Village because there's an old lady who needs stew. We need to fill this old lady with stew! Oh, now I don't know. It might end up being dubious food, though, because it's monster parts. Fuck. Well, no, it's just a dark clump. Maybe it's not. It's in, like, spices, the spice area. So maybe we can get away with making it a stew or a porridge for an old lady. We're going to save before we do it just in case it's not the right thing, though. Where is the old lady who is full of gloom? Gotta find me that old lady who needs her yummy porridge. You should buy some, should you buy some arrows? I should buy some arrows. I think I already read that. Did I already read that? I already read that. Should I buy some arrows? Maybe I should buy some arrows. Did I read that? I already read that. Should I buy some arrows? I definitely should buy some arrows. Did I already read that? I already read that. Hi. How do I make porridge again? Teach me the rules. Milk and wild greens, okay. Okay, so if I do... We're gonna save before we do it, that way we don't waste any materials. Uh, let's see, alright. First, hold this. Then we hold milk, rice, greens. I made porridge. Where's your grandma at? That didn't work. Hmm. Damn it. I really thought that would work. I really thought that would be like groom resi gloom resistant. Interesting. Okay. Weird. There's not like a flower or a plant that grows up above that like stops the gloom. Why can't I just give her a meal? Here. Yeah. Yeah. 
Why isn't that it? Yeah. Thank you, James, for the two year two tier two sub, bub. -bub. Huh, what the fuck? I definitely thought she would want this. Okay, I'm gonna look it up. Lastly, Tears of the Kingdom. Okay, let me take a look. Ah, uh, to complete Gloomborn illness. I got you, shush. Uh, sunny Veggie Porridge. Oh, I've had it all along. I'm fucking stupid. It can restore health depleted by gloom when cook... Fucking... I've had it this whole fucking time. This whole fucking time, dude. Hey, I have porridge for you. It's porridge, you smell. Give it a try. Here's your porridge. I come. I didn't know I had the ingredient this whole fucking time. Oh my god, Brendan. Mm. Penis. Ah. Ah. We normaled Grandma. We normaled her. You're welcome, Grandma. We normaled you. Grandma looking at me being like, I can't believe I ate the whole thing. <laughs> grandma. Thank you, Grandma. Thank you, Grandma. You're really cool. I love when you help me in school. You do my homework for me, and you do it for free. Thank you, Grandma. You are super busy. You're always at the factory late at night, looking at the gears and the metal inside, making contraptions. Please stop that. You're going to take over the town. That's a crazy song, Brendan. Crazy, crazy chorus, too. Insane song, Brendan. I can make so many songs about Grandmas doing fucked up things. Stop taking advantage of your grandma, Brendan. I have to put her in the factory. She needs to make contraptions for me. She's making clockwork soldiers for me so I can take over the town. Damn those nasty do-gooders trying to stop me and my clockwork soldiers. Keep working on that, grandma. You got it. Your hands are tiny so you can get up in there and move the gears. <laughs> oh, the wrong shop. I don't care. I'm out of here. I'm going to go to the clothes shop. Actually, I should buy arrows while I'm here. Arrow store. Give me. I'm gonna buy all of them. Give me all of them. Cool arrows. Give me all of them. Every single one of them. Alright, we can finally we can finally look at how much the luchador outfit costs us. We can fuck up. Mucha lucha! Mucha lucha! It's a way of life! I think it just made the villain for the next Power Rangers season. Yeah, it's literally... Ah, hello, Power Rangers. Can you deal with my clockwork soldiers? Grandma. Grandma, Grandma, finish up that clockwork... Finish... Grandma. I need that shit. It glows like bone in the dark. I need it. It has a championship belt. Oh, I get a special gift. Ooh, I will. I want to sell. Hey. Clockwork soldiers already exist in Power Rangers. Yeah, okay, well, your mom already exists in Power Rangers, and every single Power Ranger is gangbanging her all at the same time, so... I'm sorry, that was a little mean. That was fu <laughs> That was fucked up! Your mom is not fucking every single Power Ranger. I'm so fucking sorry. It's not happening. That was a violent... That was a violent rebuttal there. I... <laughs> That was a that was a violent rebuttal there. I apologize personally. 
I don't think your mom is getting fucked by every single Power Ranger. Bill S. Preston, Theodore Logan, Spock, The Rock, Doc, Hawk, and Hulk Hogan. That came out of nowhere lightning fast. I... <laughs> And he kicked Chuck Norris in his cowboy ass with the bloodiest battle the world ever saw. Civilians looking on in total law. Oh, big sippy. Thank you. Mm, yum. Love the taste. Love the crunch. Can't get it out of my head. What do they buy for big money? They buy the golden apple for eight. I want to be able to afford all of these. So what should I sell that's worth it? All right, we'll sell fifth. No, no, don't sell all of them. I need mushrooms. I'm hoarding. I'm hoarding. I'm hoarding a little bit. I'm hoarding. I wish I could sort by most. God, I wish I could sort by how many I had. I guess I can sell like 12 meats. I don't mind selling 12 meats to somebody. Somebody needs like 12 meats. I don't mean, I don't mind selling like five of these or 10 of these. I got a lot of meat. I got a lot of thinguses. I don't ever use the chicken. I can sell all my chicken. <laughs> Take all my chicken. You know what? I'm in a nice mood today. Take all my chicken. It's yours, my friend. <laughs> I'm embezzling from the meat car once again to pay for my lucha outfit. I can buy two pieces of the Lucha outfit. I need 800 bits. Oh, Sheikah fabric. Thank you. Eight hundred. Oh my god, ma'am. All right, let me see what I have that I can sell for. Let's see. I had a lot of dick, had a lot of dick. I've had a lot of time, had a lot of time. <laughs> you had a lot of dick, JC, but you ain't had mine. De -de 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 -de. Let's do 20 of these. I just need to sell a couple of things. Damn, I'm going to keep that. That's a really gem, really cool gem. I got to keep it forever. Uh, I can sell some of this electric Safina. I can sell 11 sneaky mushroom. Just trying to get to 800 rupees. <laughs> I can sell six of these. I'm fine having like 10. I like keeping, you know what? Increments of 10 are fine. So we can get rid of like some of the extra. <laughs> I just really, really fucking need the full radio, uh, the full luchador outfit. I need it. Brenda, do you need the full Luchador outfit? I need it. Not only do I need it, I need it. Sorry, Link. I don't give credit. Get in the ring, Link. Fight for me. If you fight in the ring, Link, you will be rewarded handsomely. I'll morse you. Can't do this to me, dude. Sorry, Link, I don't give credit to you. Alright, uh, how close are we? <laughs> you fight for Morshu now. Not God, not country. You fight for Morshu. Alright, we're getting there, though. We're getting there. <laughs> closer and closer we get to the... Once more into the breach, my friend. Closer and closer we arrive. Into the woods and down the dale. What else can I sell? I'll sell three of these, sure. <laughs> what else don't I need right now? I can sell three tomatoes. You know what? I can sell 13 tomatoes. That's too many tomatoes. We can get rid of some tomatoes, right? <laughs> no more cherry tomatoes. You know what? Take two of my crickets. Give me four dollars. God, imagine being able to... Imagine being a kid and you go to the gas station and you're able to sell bugs to the clerk for money. 
I got so I found three bugs today. Can I have fifteen dollars? I found three bucks today. I want to get a bug juice. That's how you pay for bug juice. You pay for bug juice when you were a child with bug. If you pay for bug juice with bug, they give you the extra special bug flavored bug juice. I got a. I found a cool bug today. Do you want to buy it from me? That would think that'd be awesome. Will you buy this cool bug from me? I found it in my backyard. I need a hundred dollars, please. I. <laughs> It's a hundred dollar rhino beetle. It's a cool bug. You want to buy it for a hundred thousand dollars? I think that'd be cool. All of this for a Lucidor outfit. All right, but hey, let's be honest here. Be real with me here. Doesn't this look tight as fuck? Step into the ring, brother! Oh, yeah. Some people think they're the champion. I get it, I get it, I get it. Oh, yeah. They think they're stronger than me. They do. Oh, yeah. But I'm out here in Kekariko Village uh, with the cream. The cream always rises. Oh, yeah. Stronger than you've ever seen before. I'm the champion. Uh, the champion. Uh, you want to fight the champion? Uh, you better step up. Uh, Literally, the, I'm literally the champion. You literally better step up. Uh. I got six. Awesome. I uh, want more hearts. I'm Skullamania. Running wild on your bone size ready. Think you're going to stop me, kid? Oh boy, another heart container. Oh boy, we up to six. Dip into the ring, brother. We the real champion. Uh, speaking of real champion, I gotta go to the cooking pot, make fucking uh food. I need cold porridge and hot porridge. I should make two cold porridge. Well, maybe not two cold porridge, but I should make two fucking two fucking foods. At least be a boy who can make two fucking foods. So what gimmick will get pushed on the link if you were to join the WWE? Pot Smasher. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Chickens fucked me up. I didn't mean to. It was an accident. I got fucking owned. I did not mean to get fucking owned. This was an accident. I... I just, I fell into the funny little pit. Ah, uh, that's why. I see. So the, the, the thing that you can get to save that lady for the porridge is right there. There's a sun herb right there. And so she's got those chickens guarding it to gaslight you if you decide to read like a guide or something. That's a good bit. Give golden apple. Uh, let's make a good porridge. Spicy porridge. Um, milk. Rice. Oh, made it rice balls. Okay. Milk. Rice. Greens. Let me see. Uh, what's something that... Stealthy. Cool in arid regions. I need my my cool porridge. Chili porridge. There we go. Chili. I don't think I have any more milk, do I? All right, we need more cold resistance here. This is this this is the sun shroom. All right, good. Good to know. I'm going to make a nice meal, dude. This is going to be an awesome meal. Uh, 
damn, it's dubious. I really thought the bomb plant would blow up inside of it. Oop. All right, better to mix and match this with shit. Need way more heat resistance. Also need some mighty steamed steak. This rice balls? Yeah, that's egg and rice. Okay. Egg and rice is also really good to make for everything. I know how to make egg and rice. That's easy. You put that shit into pot. That shit worked that way. There we go. Good cold resistance. Really good heat resistance. There we go. Also, just got to make some random fucking food. Tasty and tasty. God, I need food. I wish, I wish you could speed this up at all. I really do. Because, like, sometimes, man, sometimes, this should just take a bit. Mm, fried green. You can put a leaf in there. Okay, you can cook with leaves. God, I wish there was like a fucking a food factory, right? Slop that shit in the food factory. Just see what happened. All right, how much food do we have now? We have a bunch of food. That's good. All right, um, then let's go back to the Gerudo Valley. I, I wanted to go back to the Gerudo area because I wanted to get over there somehow for the, uh, the main quest. There's the Ruffian Festive Village. I can't do anything about that yet. Signature food. Can't do that yet. Uh, input in the geoglyphs. Don't care about that yet. Regional Phenomena is the one I wanted to try to do, or at least get to the Gerudo Village. Uh, maybe I should go see Impa, actually. You know what? Probably better to just go see Impa. More story relevant than where I am currently, and I can figure out where this tower is. Make a thin stew of fish, vegetables, prawns, coconut milk, and four kinds of rice. Get the spices right or you'll be driven to madness trying to find them. Find what? The, the spice? Like what? Would you eat an onion like an apple for $20? If I had an onion, absolutely. I don't have one though. 100% I need an onion. I do it on camera, too. Shelby, do we have an onion? Do I have an onion? It's a Simpson joke. I thought you get it. I don't get every Simpson joke. I get some Simpson joke. Some Simpson joke. Some. Oh, my God. Why he have the huge beak? I didn't know the, the beak got that big. What the fuck? I didn't know they made seagull boys. This is the guy that delivers babies. That's insane. This is literally the guy that delivers babies. Insane. <laughs> yeah, the same name as that famous swordsman. This is totally fucking Illumination Pictures famous baby movie. He's a pelican. Oh. He delivered the baby. This man will fuck your wife. Nothing you can do about it. Oh my god, he's a newspaper bird. 
Soar long. Fucking dude. What a silly little newspaper guy. Ooh, look at me glowing. You get a strong fucking champion here. I love that I fucking glow with this gear. This is good gear. I know this gear has no fucking epin bonus, but it's good gear nonetheless. I want to do that shrine. I'm popping up those two shrines. Gonna try to just get over there. He's Big News Morgan! He's Big News Porgan because he's Pelican Morgan. Easy. Just like me when I'm watching Star Wars The Last Jedi and I see the little creature and I start fucking porking out and there's nothing I can do about it. I just have to sit there and fucking take it and go, I'm porking out! I'm porking out! Why did I say that with the same enthusiasm of the man in gauze? The man in gauze? Wait a second, I gotta eat my stew, my refreshing stew. Isho Dag Shrine. Isho Dag these nuts. Got him. Windy device. Oh, you're teaching me about what all the... Oh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. You know what? You're right, video game. I didn't realize the potential of the fucking goddamn fans. I fucking forgot that they could literally just do that. Oh, shit. Smart. I never thought about how the fans could shoot you up like that. Not fucking once. Completely forgot they were wind core. Holy fuck. I'm dumb as hell when it comes to this shit. I know about this. I know I can make that boat. That was literally in the tutorial, so. And then this will let me... This will... I get this too. This will let me shoot the, uh... The platform up here. I like the shrines that teach you... All of the little things that you can do with the little toys. I see. And then you come over here. Slop this little guy on. I see. Fucking sick. I love fucking learning like this. Do -do 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 -do. I got a little opal for my trouble. Man, I think if they gave you gems in school instead of like grades for doing a good job. Or like candy. I think if I got gemstones in school, I'd definitely be a lot more into school. Like, oh, great job, Brendan, on that history report. Here's a sapphire for you. <gasps> cool rock for me. That's how you get me. This is how you this is how you uh this is how you uh motivate me with cool rocks. Alright, and then pop our butt up here. Oh we go up here. Just like me when I love using the power of wind. Great job, Link. You've done it. Utilizing the power of wind. I love it! I love the power of wind!
One more shrine. Yes, sir. One more shrine and we get another stamina upgrade. And here people say that some people say that wind power isn't a viable energy source. It totally is. Have you ever seen a wind meal? <laughs> Bet you wouldn't need it. I <laughs> I'm the worst man on this fucking site. I have to reiterate that every time I do a joke like that. I'm the worst fucking guy on this site. No holds barred. No fucking problem saying it. I'm 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 accepting of it. Worst man on this fucking site. Tree is evil. Grow up, maybe. Ooh, third. Ah, oh, the evil tree give you cool stick. I should fight an evil tree more often, shouldn't I? Thick stick, sturdy stick. Stick thick, sturdy stick. Turn this son of a bitch into a little axe. Thick axe. Any gold apples? No. Oh, there is a gold apple. Literally, it makes it worth checking the trees. Every goddamn fucking time, it makes it worth it now. They literally found a way to get me invested in the fucking apples in Breath of the Wild. Like, the fucking apples! I see a tree now and I have to be like, it got a gold one? It got a gold one? It got a gold one on there? There a gold one on there? There a gold one on there? Oh, what's my arrow counter at? 26, that should be enough. Hey, bitch. Wake the fuck up, get the fuck up. Hey, bitch, wake up. Get up, big boy. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to fall like that. Son of a bitch. God damn it. He's going to throw a rock at me, isn't he? I just, I literally wasn't paying attention. Heartbreaking. Come here. It's a good bow, too. Hit him in the cock. Hit him in the cock. Got him. Cock defeated. Cock destroyed. A lot of apple. A lot of palm fruit. A lot of toenail. Thanks, dude. There we go. Good sword. All right, we good. Uh, still have yet to see Hestu or anything, but maybe we'll find him one day. One day we will find Hestu, and that day is not today. I know somebody knows where he is, but uh, well, I'll find him one of these days. When I get way too many Koroks, then I'll start being like, okay, where's that fucking guy at? I'll look him up. Be like, where's that fucking guy? Where's that seed man at? He's always at the last place you look. I fucking guarantee it, dude. I understand that. Money rabbit. Got him. Thank you, money rabbit. Yikes! Oh, are you scared, dude? Are you afraid of a little hole, huh? What's a bubble frog, by the way? You want to tell me what those are? I have a bunch of those gems. Two folks at Woodland Stable in Northeast Elden. Uh. Northeast Elden. Yeah, I don't know where that is. Well, that just means that there will be... That just means that there will be a quest. 
Okay, so there will be a quest for these bubble frogs or something. All right, I'll find somebody to talk to about it. Well, I need to be talking to everybody at a stable. Oops. Didn't want to talk to you. One of these peppers, dude. I don't know you. Oh, shit. There's a scary creature. There's a couple of scary creatures in here. All right. Alright, this is easy. Where's my shock fruit at? Oh, I got him too. Thog. Bye-bye, little guys. Give me your orb. Nah, I don't need that. Thank you, though, Chepst. I do appreciate those chaps with lots of thing in them. I'll take that, sure, Yamber. Oh, it's slippery. I see, I see. You want to be slippy? You want to be slippery? Well, guess what, dummy? I got sticky elixir. You're gonna, you're not gonna fucking stop me. I'm sticky as hell. I stick to every surface. You literally can't stop me. You're trying to... You think a little bit of... Oh, shit. A little bit of wetness will stop me. Oop. Only a tiny bit, though. Think a whole lot of wet is going to be able to stop me, Daniel. I'm slippy as hell, dude. I'm slippy as hell. I got frog slime all up in my body. I'm slippery as hell, dude. the fuck is oh there's a guy above me i didn't even realize Brayman. gotcha where the bubble frog at gotta find me my my bubble frog ah there's a secret behind this waterfall Fucking knew it. Oh, shit. What in the fuck? Funny little shrine? Climbing gear! Climbing gear! Are you enjoying this game? I'm loving it. What the fuck did it say? Brennan, can you show me your map? No. Find it on your own, nerd! Uh, anyway, climbing gear is uh, here, if you want for reference. I don't have the map unlocked, but it's at this cave. Right here, by Karak Bridge. <laughs> I'm a helpful Henry. Don't drown, Link. Don't drown, Link. Thank you. No, fuck. Did not mean to do that. Shit. Me found the climbing gear, though. I'm a helpful Henry. Love being a helpful Henry. Hello, six ducks. I will find the other climbing gear eventually, or at least I will. Glad I found the other uh, chest place, though. That's why I just like to explore and fuck around, because then I find the things that I want. Die. Give me your fucking crystal. Give me your jam. Give me your jam. Hand it over, nerd. Pog frog. Frog pog. Frog pog. Pog frog. Whenever I try to play the game, it runs in like 20 seconds. Aw, oh, that sucks, dude. I'm sorry. Uh, I have the Switch OLED. I don't know if that helps. I have a launch Switch, too, and I haven't tested it on that. Uh... It's because I don't have a cartridge either, and I'd have to just re-download the whole damn thing. But I have a lot. I have a Switch OLED, if that helps any, to figure out, like, performance shit. Also, check your fan on your Switch, by the way. Remember, your Switch has a fan. Like, don't forget about that. 
Like your Switch has a fan, it can get clogged with dust. It can heat up. Always remember to clean out your video game consoles at least every couple of months once. Because heat issues, heat issues can happen and will happen. Maybe this is more optimized for the OLED. The OLED has a similar interior. Like, I think it has a newer chip, but even the newer Switches have the newer chip as well. The only difference in the OLED is it's a little bit larger and it has a bigger screen. It doesn't have a lot of new technology in it. Like... I get the same performance on this on my OLED that I would my launch switch. Maybe like 1% worse because it's a launch switch. But if I had a switch, a normal switch made the same time as the OLED switch, so performance would be pretty much the same. Like one to one. Yeah, Brent Daniel here with handy, helpful hints. Uh, make sure to check your video game consoles for dust. Because that shit get dusty sometime. And that the way that it dubious be. Brent, I got the fancy white Joy-Cons. I had the fancy white Joy-Cons. I lost them. I don't know where they are. I completely lost them. Oh, I like this. It's trying to teach you that fire, fire word. I see, I see. Teach me about fire. Hmm. All right. We put a Crandall here. And it takes us up, up, and away. Firework? It fucking should. I paid good money for it. <laughs> there it goes. Oop. Where's the button at? There's the button. <laughs> they really forgot about Ascend. Does exploration feel more rewarding in this than it did in Breath of the Wild? I feel like I ever, all I've ever picked up were uh, opals and Korok seeds. I would say exploration is a little bit better, yeah. Um, I would say this world, if I could say anything about the uh, Tears of the Kingdom world and why the game uh, does well because of it, is literally the fact that this game has an incredible, like, incredible sense of density compared to Breath of the Wild. Like, it's very, very dense. Why link in the Gimp suit? I'm wrestling. This is my Lucha mask. Uh, it's very dense comparatively. Uh, if I could compliment it just a little bit. Whereas Breath of the Wild felt a little bit empty and relished in the emptiness, you got the Skylands, the deep dark below, and you got your normal world. So I I, I would say the, the sense of exploration I get from this is similar to the sense of exploration I would get in a video game like Elden Ring. Which I know that the comparison to Elden Ring has been made many a time, but it's the density and the scale of the game that really makes it feel that way that it do. And that's where I think Tears of the Kingdom excels, is it's like Breath of the Wild, but incredibly dense. Just like me. Yeah, Tears of the Kingdom is the perfect sequel, because it is just, you liked that video game. How about I give you more of that video game? Right? Oh, I thought there'd be a chest up here. I was like, why can't I get up here? Damn. No chest. Yeah, but does it have women feet? Woman feet like Elden Ring does? Aw, oh, damn. I don't know about that. It would be a little dubious in regards to that. All 
All right, so I need to make... Oop, I fucked up. Fire orb. I might be able to get that back. We'll see. We'll see. How the fuck do people go into shopping malls bare feet? How do people just in general? Like, dude, I'm never going to understand the bare feet, like, fascination, like, ever. Uh, like, I don't get it. Like, I got to put those, I got to put those grippers away. I do. God, there's a ladder. What a thrill. It's darkness and silence through the night. What a thrill. You're so supreme. I just, I've seen people walk into the Best Buy when I worked there with dirty fucking feet, like big yellow toenails, like the nightmares. Like the nightmares, dude. The nightmares. Some people just be like that. They just get out there with their fucking gross ass feet. Orb open. Great job. Now we get the chest orb. That was the chest orb. Got it. Oh, because the other one's going to be a lot easier because it's the baby orb. Thank you for the cool rock. Love getting my really cool rock. Feels good to get a really cool rock. Very rewarding to get a really cool rock. Very, very cool to get a very cool rock. Here, put a flame on there. Grab the last of my balloon. There it goes. Like a beautiful butterfly into the sky. Like a paper lantern into the sky. Remembering people of old. People who are no longer with us. People who are no longer here. What a beautiful sight to see. And now it's time for me to unleash 5,000 paper lanterns in the small, sleepy town of Meadowsbury. And inside each paper lantern will be a live, vicious rat. And when finally they ascend to their zenith and hit the very, very top of the sky... Then, and only then, when dead rats are raining all across the town, will they understand my fury and what it means to cross me. Hey, cool orb. Put that shit in there. More orb, more orb, more orb, more orb. I'll get my funny little reward orb. Love me my reward orb. Shrines are still hit or miss in Tears of the Kingdom, personally. Like, they're more hit than miss, and there are a lot of tutorial shrines. Because they're, there are a lot of shrines that are really cool because they're teaching you specifically how, like, one a piece of technology works. And I like that theming a lot because then it makes you realize that you have all of these avenues that you can explore with this tech. You only say that because you haven't found the Long Log Shrine. Yeah, I have. You just make Long Log, you make a bridge. Uh, the very last one was you make, like, a boat out of it, right? I have seen it. I haven't found the Long Log Shrine. Come on, dude. Definitely have found the Long Log Shrine. That's literally me. Hi. Oh. Oh. Uh. Ooh, spicy elixir. Thank ye. Are you reading the paper? What's in the paper today? Mm. Food shortage for the cold bird village. Mm. 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 Where's Beetle at? Where's our Beetle Boy at? There he is, Beetle Boy. Mm. 
beep, 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 boy. What's up with you two? Find out about the rumored beast. The rumored beast! They're trying to find the rumored beast. I wonder where it could be. This is me when I walk into the Golden Corral because there's a rumored feast. And they have a bunch of food at the Golden Corral. I need all your arrows, dude. I'm gonna have thing. I have opal to sell. I have cool rocks to sell you. Hey. How's it going? Hey, how's it going, dude? Hey, Beetle, how's it going, my man? I got cool rocks for you. Yeah, dude, yeah, you love your cool rocks, don't you, little guy? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. I gotta buy all your arrows, dude. I'm so fucking sorry. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Bug. I got no cool bugs for him. I need to be out here collecting more cool bugs. Brandon, do you have a delicious succulent meal for your anniversary? I had a chicken krahi masala and some garlic naan bread. It was very good. <laughs> Toby and I got some Indian food. It was very good Indian food. It was very tasty, zesty. $120, dude. <laughs> a succulent meal, a succulent Indian meal. Let's see. I need 120 for that many arrows. God, I'm going to be fucking empty of cash. I'm going to have to go and collect cool rocks to sell. <laughs> Shelby got a butter chicken. I had a Krahi Masala. Both were very good. Bye, all. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. I do the same thing, dude. I also got, like, a boba. I got a tiger milk tea. It was very good. With tapioca boba, because I'm a boba freak. Oh, do you need me to make a wagon for you? I love helping. Definitely do this. I just gotta find a horse for you now, right? You need a wild horse. Okay, that's fucked. There we go. Fixed it! Oh, I should have put big monster truck wheels in this son of a bitch, but I don't have them on me right now. Weld a wheel to her forehead. Come here, I got some hot glue. I'm just gonna... No, come here! I'm just gonna weld this wheel to your forehead. No, come over here. Come here. I fixed it for you. Now I just have to find you a brand new horse. I found a frog. Awesome. All right, now we just got to find ourselves a horns. Oh, up there. Our horns is up there. Nice. To give me your horns. I'll get them. I'll get them. Horses are stupid. Horses are dumb little creatures. And I'm going to freaking own this butterfly. Come here. I need you. Yes. Warm and fuzzy. All right. All right, silly creatures. I'm going to put on my funny little mask. That makes me a little bit more stealthy. All right, silly creatures. Please don't see me. I hope I can bring a horns to this lady. Please don't sell me. Please, please don't see me. Thank you, Wyndham the Man, for the prime sub. I appreciate it. Please, silly horses, don't see me. I'm just trying to be a stealthy little guy. I'm just a little creature. I'm just a little guy. I just want to be your friend. I just want to hang out and swap war stories. Mine. Yoinked. Oh, fuck. I almost got whole horse, just like it's JoJo. I think that's the hole that I was supposed to come out of. Hey, here's a wild horse for you. Hey, 
Wild horse for you. I love helping. Are any of your Breath of the Wild horses in the stable? They're all in the stable. I can bring out Ganon horse anytime I want. I can bring out TV anytime. I, I think that's one of the only things that carries over from Breath of the Wild is your stable, which is neat. I also have Epona. I can just pull my old Epona out anytime I want. <laughs> which I thought nothing would transfer over. I'm, I'm, genuinely, I'm genuinely surprised that at least horses transfer over. This wagon is sunk! <laughs> oh, because I'm a hunk? Mm, I get it. I'm I'm freaking huge. Uh what about my pony points? Show me what my pony point I Hey uh -huh. Ooh I want a reward. I want a reward now. How do I get reward? Uh -huh. I want a reward! Oh, side counter. Okay. All right. Let me go in here. Let me go around. All right. All right. All right. All right. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me my reward. Not you, Beetle. Fucking. Not you, Beetle. Go the fuck away. He's just. This Beetle is literally that one. Have you ever been in a store and you're talking to the store clerk and then somebody comes up like a customer and they also just start talking like at a GameStop? This happens mostly at a GameStop because I call them know it alls. Uh, know it all customers will, you'll be talking to another customer or like selling somebody something and they'll walk them and it'll be like, huh, great pick. What are you getting there? Uh, man, I freaking love that game. You picking up a copy of Mario Odyssey on the Nintendo Switch? Uh, man, pretty good choice. Pretty good choice. Have you heard of Super Lucky's Tale on, on the Nintendo Switch? It's also a pretty good game. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, it's a pretty nifty little platformer. I mean, it's not as hard as like Celeste. Have you played that one? You can get that on the eShop. Pretty freaking great, though. I like it a lot. Hey, you ever play a little game called Skylanders Superchargers? Oh, man, that game makes me so fucking happy, dude. Oh, I love that freaking game, dude. You get all the little figures. You got any of the Skylander figures at home? No? 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 Why are you leaving? Why are you leaving this door? Hey, come back here. <laughs> anyway, Brendan, that was pretty crazy. Do you want to talk for three hours about Sonic's feet? Every fucking time without fail. And, it's always <laughs> and it always ends in Sonic feet conversation. It needs to stop. Melania bed. What's a Melania bed? Huh. Oh. oh, the side counter is this counter. Okay, get out of the fucking way, Beetle. Receive reward. Hey. Oh, yes, I'll be right with you, sir. Huh. You'd like to get your pony points reward, right? Huh. Towing harness! Oh, shit, I can attach... I can... I can put that shit on the horns. Horse God fabric will be yours. Just one more. Just one more fabric for me. Oh shit, I forget about Hateno Village has the um the dye shop, so I can utilize these. I can finally put my fucking mirror of twilight fabric on my goddamn machine. Uh we can go back to I have a shrine here now, so we can go back to Hateno Village real quick and do that. Go to the dye shop. You can attach rockets to your horse. Rocket horse. Rocket horse. Rocket horse. It's going to be like just when you... It's like just cause when you put a fucking rocket on like a cow and you send it spinning into the stratosphere. Cow science. Cow science. Me when I'm at fucking cow NASA and I can't stop launching cows with a trebuchet. Flying beef. Flying beef. I point up at the sky and I see another cow being shot from the trebuchet. A little bit closer to the sun. Shoot another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. A whole herd is dead. A whole herd is dead. Oopsie. All the uh, all the astronauts at NASA just contracted mad cow disease. Now they're raving mad. Whoop. Gold apple. Gold apple. No gold apple. I see. I snee. I snee. I snee. I snee. Hello, die shop man. Someday a second store. Hi. Oh, die shop ma'am. Sorry. I apologize. Go buy hubby for dad. Hubsband, you're the hubsband, right? 
Oh, fuck, that's right, you're the little creature. Ooh, fabric rework surface. Yes. CC fabric. Oh, I don't want the mushroom fabric. Stop talking about CC, you little freak. Rework the paraglider. All right, let's see. What paraglider do we want? A cow. I do like the cow. That one's pretty sick. That one's pretty... I like this one. I feel like I'm walking directly into the gas station's fucking... You know when you go to a gas station and they got that weird, like, area with, like, dream catchers and, like, crystals and shit? It's just like this. I got that gas station paraglider. Oh, does it shoot us out, too? Does he, like, fucking... Does he... Do you launch my ass? He launches my ass! Right out of there! Damn, what a little freak. He do be launching me. Damn, what a little, what a little freak. He do be launching me. Twilight Princess Glider, good. Never played that game, but it's a good fucking glider. What gas stations do you live by? I've never seen crystals in a gas station. You've never been in a long road trip and you stop at a weird gas station and they got fucking crystals and dream catchers and shit. They almost always have something. Like, whenever I travel, if I stop at like a truck stop or a gas station, they always have a weird, like, like tribal and hippie aesthetic. Never? Oh, you gotta go on more road trips. You always gotta like fucking stop at one of the big truck stations on a road trip. Like one of the big trucker gas stations because they always have some kind of weird fucking area like that. IMO. The gas station to my sound tells meth pipes. All a lot of gas stations do. They're not meth pipes. They're decorative vases, or they're the uh, ooh, or they're the meth pipes. Sorry, decorative crystal roses with a little meth pipe that has the crystal rose inside. And it's like these are not meth pipes. They are not. We promise. They're decorative crystal roses. It's like, that's a fucking meth pipe. It got a little orb at the end and a, and a thin stem. You're putting crystal in there. Not the kind of crystal you're supposed to put in there, but you're putting the crystal in there. Impa. Imp, I could totally fucking help here. Imp, I'm literally a genius. Imp, don't worry, I'm literally a genius. I'm literally a genius. I'm huge brained. I'm fat brained. I'm fat with brain wealth. You know how many fucking you know how many you know how, you know you know how many fucking brain I have? An infinite amount of brain. You're so fucking welcome. I gooed up your goddamn your uh the, 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 balloon. I fixed it. Yeah, let's go to the geoglyph. Let's check it out. One final thing for me. Will you kill me, Link? Link, will you kill me, Link? Link, please, will you kill me? Oh, now that's not Pura. No, uh, Pura is an adult now. She's like a she's 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 a fully grown woman. She's not old, but Pura is in the uh, the starter town. Incredibly normal. Where Flint at? There we go. The joke has gone too far. Oh, do you thought I was going to kill you, Impa? I'm so fucking sorry. Impa's the old lady from uh, Kakariko Village. Let me see Pura, Brendan. Let's see Pura, Brendan. Oh. No. Uh, too high up. Shit. Would you like, would you look around the geoglyph for Daniel?
Oh, there, there's a rock in the hand. It's under the, it's under the rock in the hand. Got it. I'm smart. Huge brained. Under the rock. Oh, no, that's a Korok there. Yeah, ha, ha you bitch, you son of a bitch. There's the head. There are a hole somewhere around here. Thank you, Werewolf Korra, for the 100 bits. How, how did Zelda survive 100 years without aging? Oh, I don't know if they put her... If they put her, I don't know, in the... Uh, in a crystal or something? In an orbule? There's fruits over here. Cryogenically frozen in the big chamber. Sorry, Zelda. Cryogenically frozen in the big chamber once again, eh, Zelda? Oh, sorry, Zelda. Cryogenically frozen in the big chamber, eh? Damn, I really thought there'd be a... I thought there'd be it. I thought it'd be in the hand. Ah, uh, do I gotta go up there again and look at the picture? I should have taken a picture. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna go up again. Take me up. Take me uppies again. I gotta see. Alright. It wasn't there. There was a Korok in the hand. Maybe in that hole over there? There is a hole over here. So is there always going to be a hole around these then? Ah, oh, but I think I was already in here. Yeah, I already got the bubble in here and everything. So it's not the hole. It's clearly not hole filled. Fucking go up there again. And never mind, the balloon is stuck now, huh? <sighs> Fuck, there was just a Korok in there. Search the most likely spot to find it. Dragon's tear. Oh, eyes. I'm fucking stupid. Tear, eyes. Uh, either that or something tear shaped. Duh. Brendan. Balloon stuck. Yep, sorry about that, Impa. You lost your means of locomotion. I do apologize, Impa. Wasn't my fault, though. I blame you. Oh, shit. Oh! What the hell? Hole? What kind of weird hole is this? What what does this do?
What? Oh. Oh. She's gonna take you back to the past to see the goats who here to kick ass. She'd rather have a buffalo. To startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. And could we ask what your name is? I, I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule, Zelda. What an unexpected answer. We are the king and queen who founded Hyrule, after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? And you're the king? Mm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonia? Uh, well, that must mean... Gonna be a time traveler. Gonna be a time traveler. Cool orb, cool water orb. Love me, my memory. Memories unlogged. Cool. So those hieroglyphs have the memories in them. Got it. Neat. So I gotta, I gotta do the geoglyph to be able to find the memory. Nick, what's wrong? I found a water orb, ma'am. Oh. Okay, something about the uh, the glyphs at the. Okay, there, neat. Let's go to this tower. I need a big hitter. There we go. There's my big axe. As Fromus char as Fromus Framus Framus character Olaf says. Oh god, they're bombed there. He doesn't say that. He doesn't <laughs> Olaf doesn't say that. I say that. Oh god, I did not know this was gonna be a battle talus. Jump. Almost got me, you son of a bitch. By attack power, I should have a bunch of blue bacoblin horns. Missed. Gotcha, bitch. Now break, burst open and mix. Lost your hut, didn't you? Lost your house, didn't you, bitch? Lost your silly little house. Lost your silly little house, didn't you, bitch? Sorry, bitch. Lost your silly little house, didn't you? Your fucking rock house is destroyed. Don't ever do that to me again. Don't ever try to summon a rock house after me ever again, or I'm gonna freak out at you. Never, never, never again. Well, at least the Bacoblins had a bunch of yarrow on them. That's something. Korok Frond Guster. What in the hell? What in the goddamn is above me? The dragon. I was wondering. I was wondering what the hell that ominous shadow was. I was. I was a little fucking afraid. Uh, what do I want to put? Don't I think I could put that on? 
Nothing cool that I can put that on, and my weapons are all kind of mostly good. Yeah, that just makes it 16. Nice to have, but not really useful for me right now. Alright, where the fuck the there the tower at? Gotta get me to the tower. Gotta go activate the tower. Gotta go fly up into the fucking sky. Gotta be a sky boy. How many hours in are you? I don't know. Um, let me see. I don't know. Is there a statistics page? Yeah, I don't know. This a real game? Yeah, a real video game for gamers. Switch menu time played. I don't know how to do that, sorry. Yeah, I'm really gaming out here. Do you see how you can tell that I'm a real gamer? Go to your Switch account and check time played. I don't want to do that right now because I don't want to show off my, my my Switch account. I don't want you to know it. You're going to send me... You're going to fucking see my friend code. You're going to spot it. I'm going to be really upset. I'm going to be like, stop. Give me your fire fruit. There we go. Rod, I don't need you to know my friend code. Jeez, I'm not adding you on the Switch, okay? Stop asking. Brendan, please add me on the Switch. I want to play Splatoon 3 with your fans, Brendan. Stop. No, I don't want to be a squid or be a kid right now. I want to be just a little guy exploring the world. Go to your settings and then payment method and show me. <laughs> oh, dude, you want to see the last four digits of my credit card number and the funny little numbers in the back as well? Dude, I love helping out. Dude, you need my credit card numbers for a small loan so I can fucking buy a truck? Dude, awesome. Play hero shooter paladins with your fans, Brendan. I'm not playing fucking paladins. I cannot wait to play paladins and use the guy to shoot the gun. Ugh. What a cool game. I'm gonna play Realm Royale with all my fans, so everybody better jump on the Realm Royale servers right now. We're gonna have a real epic time. Awesome, dude. Realm Royale? That shit's almost like Radical Heights. That's busting. Oh, damn. This, uh, this is son of a bitch kind of tower, huh? That's cool. They left me a lot of materials, so... Nothing says you're a loving and loyal uh, streamer. Show your fans your credit card info today. Listen, you got to grow an audience on Twitch, right? You want to know the best way to do that? Show your credit and debit card information on stream. Always works for me. And then any of the charges that they charge, they're fraudulent. So, one, you can get your pesky problem watchers, your problem viewers, uh, arrested for credit card fraud. And then, two, you get a lot of people who are posting clips like, Hey, that's the guy who leaked his credit card information on stream. You're damn right it is, and I do it every month, and it always works. Listen, the Twitch the, the Twitch meta is simple. All you have to do is show me your credit card information and the three funny numbers on the back. The Twitch meta is literally that simple. It's never been an easier time to be a large streamer. If you want to be a large streamer, all you have to do is show your credit card information and show your feed. The two things you have to do. Oh god, I'm a little lost here. This will work. Oh my god, the fucking... It's lagging a little bit, so it's really confused about where... Oh 
my god, why is it doing it this way? There we go. Up, up. There we go. Jeez. There is nothing funnier than Brent Daniels' credit card numbers. Ah, oh, jeez. And it's just hilarious. Makes you larf every time. All right, this just work. This son of a bitch just work. All right, this son of a bitch was just a puzzle. Got it. Oh fuck, sir. A second twink hit the Pentagon. No. If offline TV has taught me anything, it's that streamers love, love, love when random fans show up to their house. If offline TV has shown me anything, it's that streamers really like, like, live on the drama. It's like soup for them. So I need to start a bunch of drama with a bunch of people really fucking fast. They love it. It's like a, a warm bone broth to them. To be starting Twitch drama like a uh, <laughs> Fat Panda. One second. Fat Panda. Sandwich Master. The Maestro. Big Boy Slim. Dude, I hate that these guys, Fat Big Panda, Boy Maestro Slim, Master. have been talking to me all in the Discord all day long. These these big streamers named Fat Big Panda, Boy the Sandwich Slim. Master. They've just been saying things over and over again, and it's been crazy, and I'm sick of all this Fat Panda, Big Boy Sandwich Slim. Master drama that they're trying to start, all right? I'm just trying to do some GTA RP, and then they come into the server, and then they say things, awful things, and their names are thus. Fat Big Panda, Boy Sandwich Slim. Master. This is the drama template. Damn, I sure am sick of the shit that Big Boy Slim is saying online. Can't wait until he gets banned. God, I'm so freaking sick of the maestro doing all this shit on his Twitch stream and nobody's calling him out for it, but I'm calling him out right now. Hey, the maestro, I'm sick of your shit and I'm sick of your content as well. I think that the maestro is not good at what he does and I think he's bad actually. <laughs> it's literally the template, dude. It's literally the template. Fucking epic. Uh, we can try regional phenomena, because there's the, oh yeah, the, the boys, the watermen. Oh, we can do the watermen, because we can see Sidon. You're right, we should do the watermen. Where he tower at, though? Oh, is it cold up here? Oh no, this is Rito Village. This is not the... This is Rito Village. This is bird people. Yeah, this is bird people over there. Oh, whatever. We'll go to bird people. Fuck it. Fuck it. We'll go to bird people. How do I unplace the pins? Oop. I see it now. It's either right in there or right in there. There we go. What do you guys think the whitest song of all time is? Um, the first thing that comes to mind for me is, I dug my keys into the side of his pretty little souped up four wheel drive. Got my name into his leather seats. 
Took a Louisville slugger to both headlights. Slashed my keys into all four tires. Maybe next time I'll think before he cheats. That's the one I think of. Okay, so it's got to be uppies instead. Got it. Let me go up here. That's the whitest song. That's like the whitest song. That's got to be, dude. This, this is the tier that we need. Ah, the circle. Give me the liquid. All right, new memory. New Zelda memory. While we're around here, while we're around the Burrito Village. New cutscene, unlock. Need my memory liquid. How many fucking how many fucking millennial streamers do you think did this? And they were like, dude, it's just like the Harry Potter Dumbledore when he had the liquid and he looking at the liquid and he sees things that he did in his past that he saved in the liquid brain. It's gonna be just <laughs> I'm fucking I'm fucking calling out anybody around my age group. Fucking millennial streamers be like, dude, memory liquid, memory liquid. Just like Dumbledore's uh, fondle tray. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding? Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh, I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Raru? I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Ah, uh, I see. In any case, Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as... Not a prequel, dumbass. This is... Zelda got sent back in time. Yes. Tech Stomper, please. In my time, Rub two brain cells together sometimes. Time. I'm gonna hit you with a big rock. I need to You're not back, back in time. Zelda How is. Do I do that? I don't You're in the know. future. In the Zelda gets sent back in time. Think with your brain. Use your little noggin. I'm sure I should rub the smooth surface of your head a couple of times and then shake your head like a magic eight ball. Now, then it'll say, source is unclear. You don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle, hmm? No, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. <laughs> it is true, after all. We'll get you fresh clothes, too. I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. I don't know what Zelda they... literally looking at Link. They fly now? I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Did you guys like Jedi Survivor? I'm sure there's somebody probably who liked that game. I, I didn't get it because I didn't really like Fallen Order that much either. I thought Fallen Order was alright, but I can never beat that game. I beat the Ogdo Bogdo, that's all I need. Beat the Ogdo Bogdo before you get your big powers, and that's all you need. That's what I did. I was just like, all right, Ogdo Bogdo done, means I'm done too. Well, I, I don't know what it is with, like, the, the, uh, the respawn, the first one. I just didn't like how it never felt like anytime you were presented with a puzzle, there's one solution to the puzzle, and you have to do it that way, because the game wants you to do it that way. And I don't really quite like that in videos game when they do that. Versus, like, this is the way you do this. It's the only way you do it. Any other way is fucking wrong. Oh, there's a Lionel up here. Hoof. Fallen Order was, like, okay. I just, I also didn't like that it kind of had... 
Not 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 quite souls like, but just a little soulsy. You know, in the way that it did things. I mean, it's a Metroid, a Metroid Souls-like, I guess, is the best way to put it. A Metroid-like and a Souls-like. It's a character action game. Not a character action. It's like a stamina-based action game, but with some Metroidvania elements to it. I just, eh. And also, I feel like with Fallen Order and Jedi Survivor, it's it's enhanced the same way that the Spider-Man PS4 game is. Whereas, if you, if you like some Star Wars things, you're going to like it a lot more. Same with uh, same with Spider-Man PS4. I thought Spider-Man PS4 was pretty good. I didn't think it was like the best game ever. But if you love Spider-Man, that game is going to be your 10 out of 10 game. You're going to be thinking about it all the time. I love helping. I love helping people at the hostel. There's hostels at the hostel. I love assisting. Ooh, funny elixir. Shield surfing. Yeah, I know shield surfing. They told me about shield surfing. How nice. Professional shield surfer. There's a legendary shield somewhat surfer somewhere in the Hebrew mountains. Yeah, thanks. I have a bunch of shields already, but thanks. Thanks for the offer. I'm uh, glad I helped you folks. Really happy that I helped y'all out. It was uh, it was very worth it. That's not that's not me. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. It was very worth helping you out. I'm just saying. Very very glad to help you out. Love to help you out. Love to help out a couple of citizens in need. All right. That's just the kind of guy I am. I see a citizen. I say that citizen is in need. I need to assist them immediately. And then I do. I just do. That's how I do it. Love being a helpful Henry. Love just being a guy who kills a couple of monsters and gets some funny little elixir from you. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Love my little elixir. Love me drink my heat elixir. Love a little spicy liquid, if you know what I mean. Put a little, uh, put a little, put a little pepper in there. Drink it up. I used to think it, thinking about like fucking spicy liquid drinking. Uh, for a while when I was a kid, uh, I, I for like a year I was in foster care, right? Which is like the sad part of the story. That, that literally doesn't matter. Um, but while I was in foster care, I had to go to a different home for like a month. And I think about this kid often. There was a kid. At what at this foster care home that I was at for like a month while my uh, other foster family was on like whatever vacation, uh, and he would drink hot sauce right out of the bottle. He'd have this big bottle of sriracha, and he'd just drink it directly out of the bottle, like in fucking sane. And this kid was like their favorite in the family, right? Like everybody would be upstairs playing. Uh, I think it was NBA Streets or something on the PS2. And this kid would be every fucking day, every time I looked at him, he'd just be drinking out of a big bottle of sriracha hot sauce. No matter what the fuck he was doing, wherever the fuck he was, they would always buy him this big fucking bottle of sriracha hot sauce. Without fail. And I just, I just, I fuck, how the fuck? I mean, I don't like like hot sauce very much, but I'm just in fucking awe. How are you just sitting there drinking that shit like liquid? Like that's just yummy liquid for you? That's that's what that is? That's your yummy liquid? I just ain't get it. I just ain't get it. Oh, uh, there's bad guys in here. Hello, silly guy. Cool rock, silly guy. I know you got your pokey stick, dude. That's cool. That's cool. Cool pokey stick, dude. Lumen! I also have a pokey stick. Do you like my pokey stick? Mine functions better than yours. Get fucking owned. That's nothing. One time I knew this guy would take cinnamon rolls and dip them in chili. Julia, that's so fucking... <laughs> that's me. And I knew that I know that you know that's me. Everybody got a fucked up food thing, all right? I'm sick of sitting here and pretending that not everybody has at least one fucked up food thing. You can't just pretend like everybody is normal. You can't, like, walk into the office and pretend like, Ooh, this is my big stack of papers and I'm incredibly normal. Everybody has a fucked up food thing. 
It's not just me. I'm not just the only fucked up one, all right? Everybody has a fucked up food thing. You're a liar if you don't. For me, it's literally just I like chili with cinnamon rolls. And I like to dip the cinnamon rolls in chili. I think that's a little fucked up, but it's not like crazy fucked up. I think drinking a bottle of hot sauce is more fucked up. You know what it is? What is the nastiest and weirdest sauce for somebody fucking drink? Like right out of the bottle. Like what what are you gonna do if you meet a motherfucker and this motherfucker pulls out a big bottle of horseradish or Worcestershire sauce? Right? Like this motherfucker drinking the Worcestershire sauce Worcestershire Worcestershire sauce right out of the fucking bottle. What are you gonna do? Ranch? No, I've met people who drink ranch. I am Midwestern. That's just normal. Some people are just a little bit fucked up. Some people literally just will grab the ranch and drink it out of the bottle. That is a that is a Midwestern kind of fucked up thing. I've seen it. What's in here? Give me the loot. Now I don't care. Don't need it. Don't care. A uh, feathered spear. What am I, a bird person? Am I going to start cacawing everywhere? A cacophony of cacawing? No, not me. No, sir. Not me. I won't drink ranch from the bottle, but I will lick it off the plate. Oh. Ranch heads, dude. Ranch heads are insane. I won't ever fathom it, ranch heads. I won't ever fathom it, but that's okay. It is not for me to fathom. I do not need to fathom it, ranch heads. I ain't need to. I understand your lust and your your, your want of ranch. I totally get it. But uh, for me, uh, absolutely no thank you. Hate ranch. I like mayo. I like mayonnaise. Mayonnaise is different than Miracle Whip, by the way, too. Like, some people really fucking hate mayonnaise, but what they actually hate is Miracle Whip. That's a, that's an important distinction to make, personally, is remembering that, like, ranch and Miracle Whip are different from each other. That is just dubious how it be sometime. Oh. I found a little place. A Sky Archipelago. Neat. What do they got up here? Oh, you can rail your way over there. Neat. I should do that. Uh, I fucking love some of these puzzles, like, a lot. Miracle Whip isn't mayo. Miracle Whip is, like, a really shitty version of mayo, basically. It's like a... It's like a sandwich spread. It's kind of tangy. But not, like, mayo tangy completely. But it is mayo tangy-ish. But I do, I do get people's hatred of Miracle Whip. I don't get people's hatred of Mayo, because I love Mayo. <laughs> Miracle Whip isn't Mayo. Yeah, but some people mistake it for Mayo. Because Mayo can be really fucking good on the right thing. Not a lot, though. Like, if I get a sandwich from a sandwich shop and it has way too much fucking Mayo on it, I understand. That shit fucking suck. Ain't getting, like, a big globule of Mayo. All right, let me see. This counts right. This little guy. This should do the trick. All right, send me up there into the frozen cold. Oh, not enough strength. Damn, do I need more wind? Well, I have another wind one at least, so I can just bring that with me. Mayo has a flavor. You gotta get, like, good mayo, though. Like, cheap mayo... There, Mayo is definitely one of those things where you shouldn't skimp out on. I think a lot of condiments, for me personally, are things you shouldn't, like, skimp out on. Because a lot of the time, condiments are... They definitely, like, are better...
If you get the nicer ones. Americans can't really do sauces. Yes, we fucking can. What the hell are you talking about? Can't do sauce. So barbecue sauce? Barbecue sauce. The amount of barbecue sauces. The varied mystery of barbecue. Is somebody from fucking across the pond telling me Americans can't do fucking sauces? Are you fucking kidding me? No, I will fucking sit down and fucking say, Americans are the sauce boss. We have so many fucking sauces. An insane amount of sauces. You have mustard. Have you ever... You haven't ever had, like, good barbecue, have you? Holy shit. I'm, like, fucking... I'm making the Jesus. I'm, I'm doing the cross. Like, I gotta fucking tell you. Good barbecue would make you reconsider. It really... Good barbecue is fucking good. You find good barbecue and you're fucking set. Let me tell you something. Good barbecue is hard to come by sometimes, but holy fucking shit. Ribs with barbecue sauce... Uh, anything, anything with barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce is just that fucking good. American sauces are like 50% sugar. Okay, listen here, Marmite fucker. Listen, listen here, Vegemite fucker. Alright? <laughs> That's why they taste so good. I... <laughs> Ooh. Fuck, dude. Fry sauce? Like, good fry sauce? Like, the shit that copies, like, Chick-fil-A's? Good fry sauce is fucking so excellent. Not ketchup, mind you. Fucking fry sauce, all right? You are missing out real bad if you ain't find good fry sauce. You are missing out real fucking good. Oh, and gravy. Oh, bless your heart, non-Americans. Biscuits and gravy are so fucking good sometimes. And also, like, I don't... Like, you just get, you just get Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce, and that shit's amazing. And that's just, like, the Sweet Baby Ray's kind. Fry sauce. Fry sauce is so fucking good. I will always prefer fry sauce to, uh, what is this shit? I will always prefer fry sauce to ketchup for fries. Always. Am I doing a Resident Evil? Not Resident Evil. Yeah, Resident Evil-style laser grid. Mission Mission Bren possible. Oh shit. Okay, so if we do... Damn it, I keep pressing the wrong button. I'm still trying to get used to the new controls compared to Breath of the Wild. This laser activates that trap door, but it also activates the door with which it has a chest. Got it. To be honest, I, for I forgot about barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce and fry sauce are both really good. I don't like them. They're just, they're just tasty. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Resident Evil fucking laser grid. There's Sans undertailing a boss fight at me. Oh, God. This is Resident Evil. No, 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 no. What do I do? What do I do? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. It is Resident Evil. Oh, my. That one really, they really tried to get me with that one. Holy shit. I almost got fucking cubed. Just like the guy in the Resident Evil movie with Mila Jovovich. You're gonna get cubed, Brendan. You're gonna get cubed. There ain't a damn thing you can do about it, boy. We're gonna squareify you, boy. Please don't squareify me. I'm just, a, I'm just a little guy. I don't want to be. I don't want to be squareified or cubified, please. Pointing, shouting, yelling, shitting, saying, I'm normal, I'm normal, I'm normal, I'm normal.
I still can't believe that one marriage powered several Resident Evil movies and one Monster Hunter movie. Paul Wes Anderson is literally a psychopath. To get like how somehow get these video game properties and then just make his wife the star of them and not even like a character relevant to the fucking properties. She's her own OC in these worlds. Like the Resident Evil movie literally is like, hey, these are these characters from the Resident Evil games. They're side characters. Mila Jovovich has psychic powers now. Isn't that awesome? I want to rewatch those movies. Shit. I should convince David to do a pondering on one. Really, really should. I should rewatch. Love to see those movies again. Burn it. Not like it matters anyway, because I can just use it. There we go. Now let's survey this son of a bitch. I just love it. The Mila, the, the Mila Jovovich and Paul W. Paul 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 W. Anderson, Paul S. Anderson movies are actually insane. They're insane fucking movies. And like, even though they're pretty fucking bad, they're insanely fun to watch as, in like a series of bad movies. Is Event Horizon where the, with the Hell spaceship? Is that the one where uh, they're literally like, they get on the spaceship and they're like, fuck this, we gotta leave. That's the Hell spaceship, yeah, I should watch that one too. That's on my list, potentially, eventually. Love the idea of a hell thing. Brent Daniel, top three movies that are so bad they're good. Uh, Kung Pao Under the Fist, uh, Master of Disguise, uh, classic The Room. I'm always going to pick The Room. I know it's bu basic bullshit. If you want non... Okay, you want non-standard answers, um, you got to do Rubber. You got to do... Um, Scorpion Thunderbolt. And you gotta do, uh, Billy, Billy, the Billy Wizard movies. They're, they're like these fake Harry Potter knockoff movies. There's two of them. And the first one has Rowdy Roddy Piper in it. You better not mean rubber with Robin Williams, Brendan. Tech Stomper. You are, you keep digging yourself into a hole. That movie is called Flubber. Flubber! He literally flubs and burrs! Tech Stomper, I'm going to fist fight you on top of the Millennium Tower one of these days. You are going to feel my burning wrath. Flubber. Flubber. Fight me. No, let's see. Scorpion Thunderbolt is really weird because it's one of these weird exploitation films that was originally filmed uh, in Asia. I think China. I think it's a Chinese movie that a man bought the rights to and he used to do this. He used to buy the rights to Chinese and Japanese movies and he would go in and he'd cut them up and add himself into them with a subplot or like the main plot that that's all new footage. So Scorpion Thunderbolt is this movie about a lady who is like half snake but they turn it into a story about this white guy finding a ceremonial sword and killing a witch. And it's very fucking good. And and you can find it on the Internet Archive. Uh, there's also prints of the DVD that you can find. I have a print of the DVD. But you can also just find it in really bad quality on the Internet Archive. Rubber is about a tire that kills people. And I think it might still be on Netflix. Uh, and then, what was the other one I said? I can't even remember the other one I said. Oh, the Billy, the Billy Wizard movies are very funny, IMO. Hurt my eye rubbing it, ow. Billy Owens, yes, Billy Owens, not Billy Wizard. Yeah, the Billy Owens movies are very funny.
Give me your pieces. There we go. Or at least the first Billy Owens movie is funny. They're just very fucking odd. They're very odd movie. All right, Link, play Flappy Bird. Ah, sad. I can't get any of those materials. Heartbreaking. They just wanted me out there playing Flappy Bird, I guess. Thog. Oh, Good Burger's really good. That's a really good So Bad It's Good movie. Um, Especially since in Good Burger, they're making a sequel now, I think, as well. Good Burger is so bad it's good. Kenan and Kel have excellent chemistry. They have excellent fucking chemistry, especially for their ages in that movie. Um, still wild that Kenan is like a SNL lifer. Like, he might have... I wonder if Kenan Thompson has the... Who... Who, who has... I wonder if he's at SNL the longest. Kenan, yeah. 20 seasons... On SNL, Keenan Thompson, 20 seasons. Of SNL for Keenan Thompson. Actually insane. Dude has been on there forever. I think he also has his own show finally now. Like his own funny little uh, NBC show. Not 100% on it, but I think he has his like called Keenan or something. Maybe it's not an NBC show. Maybe it's just a show. But I think he has his own little I'm Keenan Thompson show. Uh, bird clothes, right? Yeah, these are the bird clothes. 650. All right, that's the cold resistant stuff. I can't buy it right now, but I know it's here. Oh, do I gotta go all the way up? Oh, I thought it was down for some reason. The village is fucking frozen, mate. It's fucking frozen. The birds are experiencing an incredibly harsh winter. Oh god, the round boy is upstairs, ain't he? King round boy. All right, King Roundman, I'm here to assist and I'm here to help, and I love helping guys out. Me, I love being a pal, even a friend sometimes. Where are you, King Roundman? Ah, over here. Oh no, it's the fucking, it's the hot guy from Breath of the Wild. Sorry, bird guy. That's not fair at all. You know I can handle it. Checking out that huge cloud wouldn't be hard. I could even do it alone. Hmm. Anything. No, the asshole bird guy died. This is the bird guy with a wife and uh, Sasuke energy. Is that you? Oh yeah, it's me, Skillabone. What a little cutie. Mm. They told me you were missing. Not anymore, Tabba. Ah. It's my son, Tulin. Uh. <laughs> Listen, you. You little shit, get back here! The Stormwind Arc? Okay, so this is gonna be the big dungeon of the boat. You mentioned a song? Uh. A great flying ship. Hmm, I sneeze.
Oh, we gotta go talk to Hearth. So we help Tulin, and Tulin will get us up to the big Noah's Ark place. I think that's probably where we're supposed to go. Got it. Okay, we'll see if we can get up here. We can get to those two fires pretty easily. Yeah. Watch out for the ice wizard. Yeah. Okay, gotta go to bed. Don't be funny for the rest of the stream, Brendan. I don't want to miss any funny. Is he gone? Man, I'm thinking about starting a balaclava business. Uh, but getting confused and then making baklava instead. And then I'm making uh, balaclava out of baklava. And I'm going to make little cake masks for everybody. Little cakes and pie masks for everybody. It's going to be hilarious. They should have a Payday 2 mask. That's like the Cherry Pie Man from Master of Disguise. I think they'd be hilarious. Oh, I'm crawled. I forget. Can't be fast. Gotta be crawled. Nice. Kill the dinosaurs. Fucking Ice Age, dude. Oh, there's not a hole there. Damn it. Oh, just water. Oh, freak. Come here, you little freak. Sapphire sword. Oh, I snee. Okay, so instead of the actual magic wizard rods now, they put gem on they stick. Okay, I snee. Uh, not really useful to me, because I can't really, like, pop the gem off of there or anything. What is that? Oh, pine cone. <laughs> really fucking confused. Forgot what a pine cone looked like. Oop. Oh shit, it's the fucking- it's this guy again, son of a bitch. It's the Signman. Hello, Signman, I'm here to help. Let me fucking come over here and help you out, dude. Alright, set her down. You can let go now, bud. I know you got so many... Su Try letting go. You got it, bud. It works. Perfect. Easy. I just love holding signs. I just love holding signs. I just love holding signs. I know, dude. That's all. That's that's what you're all about, dude. I know, dude. That's what you're all about, dude. Now give me all my stuff. Red rupee. Now give me a meal. Mmm. Is that all you need to do? Oh yeah, for the signs, absolutely. You just need to prop them up. Once they're propped up, you're good. All right, is this our uh, is this our little guy, our little friend, our little pal? Are you the guy I gotta talk to? No, he's in there. He in the bird house. Well, give me these. Think of the free pepper. I appreciate it. Think of the free flint. What is this? Oil. Ooh, you can fry shit up now, right? I can make some popcorn real. Are you the guy I gotta talk to with a cool hair? Ah, he was out to find food. I snee. They were on the South Summit Cave, finding mushroom to eat. Ah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Oh. 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 Got 
sometimes Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom looks a little bit like Xenoblade Chronicles. But unlike Xenoblade Chronicles, you don't have to deal with how shitty the goddamn movement is because there's no vehicle or a car. So it's just constant walking around. I wish Xenoblade had like a fucking horse or a car or something. Like it just, I will never understand why they don't just put a car in that game. Or like a surfboard, like a really cool edgy surfboard. So you can be like, let's get wickety wickety whack with it, dude. Unbelievable what? Hi. Where's Tulin at? What if they had Rob's what if they had Rob Zombie's Dracula to drive around in? That'd be fucking psycho. Imagine being the guy who owns and operates Rob Zombie's Dracula for Rob Zombie Dracula tours. Literally running around and going, Dad, I am the one exterminator, son. Slipping through the trees, conquering the breeze. It'd be insane. I'd fucking lose my mind. Would love to own Rob Zombie's Dragula. Would love to dig through the ditches and burn through the witches and slam in the back of that Dragula. Personally, I would fucking love it. Give me the ice fruit, yeah. Ooh, also free arrow, thank you. Somebody going, oh, 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 oh these guys are. Shit. Give me that jelly. Give me that jelly. I'm a jelly boy. I'm a jelly boy. I love me jelly. I love me jelly. Give me that jelly. I'm a jelly boy. Slather me up with jelly. Call me the jelly boy. Gotcha. What did that fucker have on him? A royal sword? Ah, it's fine for now. We're fine. We don't need it. SpongeBob when he's in Sandy's dome. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. One of this game has chainsaw swords. There are some machines that if you kill, they have really interesting parts. One of them was like a, uh, you know, an auger, like a big drill with a, it, it kind of had an auger blade to it, like a big dirt drill, you know? And that was neat. And I killed that big machine and I got his auger blade. That was neat. He's a big cuboid guy. Really cool. This the uh the cave we gotta go to? Or is this the wrong cave? This right cave? Okay, they're further in the cave, got it. Good thing I went this way instead of the other way. Um I'll just throw that easier than wasting an arrow. Gotta start remembering that I can do that. Yeah. Alright, fish are mine, dumbass. They're my fish! What under this rock? No secrets. Damn it. The primal instinct to check every rock I find. The primal instinct to check every rock I find for loot. Oh damn, this cave is huge. Alright. Ooh, stuff. Ascending too far. Nope. Just the right amount. There we go. Maybe they're up in here somewhere. This is a big fucking cave. They got a lot of they got a lot of stalactites made entirely a plant.
Oh shit, silly guy. Got him. Fucking owned. Sorry, silly man. Is this to go up? Oh, I see. No, this is just a fire. I get it. I kind of get it. That's to shoot at the spines. So there's a fire there. So if you don't have stuff you can hit it with, you can just shoot it. That makes sense. I grit it. But if I was a smart little guy... Oh, I'm not. I was going to try to put the bomb on my shield. I forgot that I was centered directly towards a fire. You make a little oopsie. Sometimes you forget that a plane is entirely full of gunpowder. Sometimes you make a little oopsie. Sometimes every once in a while you make a little oopsie and you pay for your sins with blood. Oh god, where did it put me at in the crave now? I don't even know where it put me back to. Sometimes you just make a little oopsie. That's fine, it's okay. This world is full of happy little raccidents. And I'm not even that far back, so... I can redo my funny little mistake. Re- uh, not do. Not do my funny little mistake. Hurt your butt, huh? Did I hurt your hiney? Oops, got your hiney. God, he hurt he butt so hard. He butt explode. Literally me when I fall 3,000 feet. Okay, all right. I got this now. I got this now. I got this now. All right. Bomb. Drop bomb. Grab fuse. Bomb flower. Shield. Shield, jump. Bomb. Oop, shit. I was... <laughs> well, at least I didn't land in the water. Oopy. Little bit, little bit, little bit further here this time. All right, shield. Bomb. Shield, jump, bomb. Not on the spine. Jesus Christ. Okay, come on. We can do better than that. We can do better than that. We can do better than that. He'll jump bomb. Oop, that just kills the link. Okay, I did it again. You just die from that. Link just dies. What the heck? I can't believe that just kills the link. I'm fucking losing my mind over here about it. All right, I'm going to take a break. Um... I'm going to go to the bathroom, so I'll be back in a bit. Uh, if you want to leave and come back, or if you want to stay around and listen to some, uh, like, Katamari music, you can do that. Uh, but I'm going to be up for probably another hour at least playing Zelda, minimum, because I fucking love this game and I'm having a great time with it. So, give me a bit. I'll be back. All right, I'm back. Took me a while. Sorry. Sorry if you be waiting for, like, 30 fucking years. Bryn Daniels back, don't worry. I, to, I wanted to get a drink, too, and then I also had to bathroom, so it'd just be like that it'd be. Uh. 
Okay, I gotta find a way to get... <sighs> oh, wait a minute. Duh. I forgot. How, how do I keep forgetting about fucking... My silly little abilities. Oop, I forget about the blue man. The blue man still wants to fight me, yes? Where'd he go? Hi, blue man. So, sorry! Sorry, blue man! Sorry! Sorry, blue man! I, I'm so fucking sorry, blue man. So fucking sorry, blue man. I had to destroy you again. But I I, I know exactly what I gotta do. Uh, I keep forgetting about my uh, little devices. My thinguses. My items. Thank you, Werewolf Cora, for the 50 bits. Are you a scary skeleton? Yeah, absolutely. Of course I am. Jeesh. I'm just a little guy. Oh, that's not that high. Do I have... Ish, ish. Spring might also work a little better. There we are. Spring does work a little better. Should just be used in the spring. I need to get more. Oh, fuck. Rock monster. Oh, no. Where my bomb at? There we go. There we go. Sorry, Rockman. Silly little rock monster trying to get me, huh? Not me and not today, fella. I got my anti-rock pants on. You can try to fuck with me all you want, but I got my anti-rock pants on. They stop me from taking any rock damage. Oh, shit. Is this back to the entrance? Oh, wait. Where's Tulin at? Where is Tulin at? I gotta find that little guy, that little creature. Uh, the same ones that have been signing around the village. Tulin wasn't listening at all. I'm gonna follow them back to their nest and flew off alone. Damn it, Tulin. Lone cedar tree on Talanto Peak. That's where we saw the monsters. All right. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, at least I found my way out of the crave. Coming. I'm literally going to be Mr. Brightside right now. Coming out of my cave, and I'm doing just fine. Gotta, gotta be fast, because I'm in a cave. On a hill? Oh, it's that guy again. Son of a bitch, every fucking time. This guy's always chilling with a brand new fucking sign. I'm here to- you got a double sign this time. Son of a bitch. I'm helping one second. I'm helping one second. Who the fuck is gonna see this one, dude? Okay, drop it. Try letting go. I want to see what side it goes. Okay, that side. Gotcha. You can set it, reset it back up. I got ya. I got ya. I got ya. I will help you with President Hudson. Don't worry. I know you are freaking out right now, dude. But I got you. I found a big rock. Don't worry. It's not a boulder. It's a rock. Do I even have enough Zoan devices for that joke? I don't. Shit. Actually, I wonder. I know I have to help this guy, but like...
Damn it, I couldn't get it to fucking work properly. Damn it. I <laughs> One second, we got more. The pioneers used to ride these babies for miles. It's not a boulder. It's a rock. A rock. <laughs> what do you mean I can't take that out here? Thank you. Damn it, still not working, huh? Huh, fuck. That's sad. Oh well. Anyway, let go of your sign here. I helped. <sighs> Trying to make the rock ship worthy, but it just it just ain't work. Damn it. You can't, I need rockets is the thing. I need to find the rockets. Wherever, wherever dispenses the rocket orb, I need those. Once I get an infinite supply of rockets, I'll be fucking set for life. $20. I wanted a peanut. So many of this dude's little, like, pissy, shitty quests. Oh, these guys are alive again? Howdy ho! Oh, no arrows, though. This guy fucking sucks. Any arrows in here? Swallow bow! I don't need that. That's for aerial combat. Do I look like somebody who'd be into aerials in disguise? Just like System of a Drown? No, I'm not. I'm not an aerial core guy. Uh, can I great crate, maybe? This won't be a complete waste if I can get up on that hill. Crate travel! There we go. Have crate, will travel. Alright, what's this silly guy up to?
My club brogued. Okay, that's fine, dude. What is this, an icicle club? Oh, sweet. That's actually neat. Oh, shit. You can actually, like, hit him with that. Oh, that freezes the man. That's neat. Bye-bye, the man. I like that. That's pretty cool. I didn't even think about icicle go on the thingus. Huh. Did not even think about icicle go on the thingus. Wild. Okie dokie, artichokey. What the fuck was that? Who plorped at me? Who the fuck's doing that shit? Who's throwing rocks at me? Oh, I see you, you son of a bitch. Gotcha. Now give me your octo balloon. Your tentacle, give me your balloon. There we freaking go. Also, I'm a cold little guy. Uh, mm, meatballs always make me warm. Remember, mama's meatballs make me warm. M M M M W. Never forget this acronym. All right. So, cool thing about those little guys is I can. Grab one of those balloons. No, I didn't want to fuse the rock to... Why did it fuse the rock to my shield? Dwayne, get off of my shield right fucking now. Now, where are those monsters at? Where's our guy at? Now, I have that in case, but now I gotta find my guy. Where's my dude at? Where's my guy? Oh, he wasn't up here. Was it up? Oh, uppy up there. Okay, cedar tree. Got it. That's why I have... This. And it helped. That was nice to have. Like having at least one piece of the climbing gear. Makes life a little easier, but we gotta find the other pieces. Well, I gotta find the other pieces. I know somebody in the chat knows what they are. But I'm glad I at least got the shirt. I just rem remembered randomly an episode of Kids Next Door. That was like a rock opera, and I think the songs were written by Metallica. I think about the, uh, fuck, the eye, ooh, the pink eye episode a lot. And then it just fucks me up endlessly with, like, endlessly, ceaselessly, I'm always fucked up by the goddamn pink eye episode. Oh, what's up, Tulin? What's wrong, buddy? Oh, I got he funny little ability. Leave it to me. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Oh! Oh, and he follows me. He's like a little friend. He's a little comrade. All right, all right, all right, where are you at? I fucked it up. I was trying to make him do it upwards, but I don't think he can. Got him. Get your bow!
ODST dropping in. All right, dude. They're not going to make a fool out of me twice. They're not going to make a fool out of me once. How about that? Boomerang. Oh, fuck. He fights. Oh, my God. He helping. I'm so proud of he. I'm so proud of he for helping. Um, attack power. There we go. I think that shit a big sword. Kill these nerds. Defile their graves, Tula. Tulin. I'm going to keep calling him Tula, even though his name is Tulin, aren't I? Tulin. 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 He lost his bow, but it's okay. I'm your skeleton friend until the end. It's me, skeletonized Link, and I love helping. Because she got time memory or something. She got the sage brain. Zelda got the sage brain. It makes her a little goofy. Oh, no, oh. Oh. Uh -huh. we better stop that wind. Oh. Leave it to me. All right, where does it want us to go? The Sky Islands. Okay, I'm going to have to shoot myself out of the tower to do this, though. Why is Lincoln Duckburg? That's where all the bird people live. Life is like a hurricane here in Duckburg. Oh, shit, that's a hurricane here in Duckburg. The wind is whipping. The house is tipping. Ducktails. Ah! I... <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Oh, God. I don't know if I can make it over there. Shit. Oh, I can make it here, though. Nice. Fuck yeah, dude. Get uppies. Get uppied. I'm trying to get that shrine. Get uppied, dude. Give uppy. Alright. All right. Ejo shrine. Gotcha. Need this one. Give uppy my life motto. Give up in my life motto. Give Downey me at the laundromat. Because Downey's a brain of fabric softener. It's a great joke. It's a good yuck. More than defense shrine. Okay. Okay. 
Ah, they're trying to teach me what the shield be do. Okay. This is trying to teach you that shield real. Ah, and then it want me to pick up the fire shield. I snee, I snee. Means I have to drop one of my shields, so we'll drop that one. There we go. Icicle. That would be quite funny to put on a sword. Chepst. Thank you for the free arrow. Fucking awesome. Love shooting thing out of my bow. Burn. Got him. Thank you for the free stone slab shield, dude. Got it. Fire blocked. Oh, rocket shield. Got him. Give me your charge. Give me your charge. Give me your horn. So I'm presuming that rocket shield is what, what it wants me to do here, right? Uh, destroy fuse material. There we go, Thog. Good, I have a couple of those now. I wish I could orbule some of those extra ones so I could have them always, but it's all right. Got me my cool. I have like two extra rocket shields now, which will just be great. And then one more shrine, and that's two levels when I go to the next thingus. Thank you, old people statue. I appreciate you. Very cool. I love learning thing. Love showing off my incredible, amazing brain skill. Literally unbreedable. Um, okily dokily then. So we gotta get through the top of that son of a bitch, is what it wants me to do. Oh, orbules. Fuck yeah. Let me get a couple of those. Ooh, ouchie though. Drink my spicy potion. Okay. Rockets! Oh, fuck yeah, finally. Gotta just get me a fuck ton of these. Put them in the machine. I just need a fuck ton of those. Just a dump truck full of rockets. I don't need all those bombs. But I do, I do want every rocket you have. Please. And now I know where to get the rockets at, so. If I ever want to grab any more, I can always get more. But I have... How many rockets do I have? 17 of them? I think that's good for now. That's a good amount of rocket. Uh, let's see here then. What else is in this little funny little sky island? Probably some Zonai charges. Probably maybe a robot, robot or two. Maybe a little, maybe a little Karak seed. Karak? Korok seed. Turok seed. Real? The underground in Cedars of the Kingdom literally scares the fuck out of me. Yeah, I'm kind of afraid to go down in there. <laughs> not gonna lie, kind of afraid to go into the underground. I haven't been there yet. I'm like, I'm not gonna fuck around with that for a little bit, I think, until I have more health and better armor. I just don't want to deal with it. Got 
gonna fucking fall into the underground and find sand under tail, and then I'm gonna shit my pants just like Sans would want me to. I'm going to laugh when Undertale is real in Zelda. You ever forgot how to upgrade the battery? Nah, but I will at some point. I bet it's somebody you talk to for like a part of a quest line. I'll figure it out. I don't need hints though, don't worry. If I figure it out, I figure it out. If I don't figure it out, I don't figure it out. That's just the way that should be. Get up here, find out what's in this funny little chest. Another old map. Still don't know how to use those either, but I'll figure it out. What is this tree here? A mighty suspect. God bless anybody who gets hit by that tree. God bless. Ganon's just walking. He's alive again. He's rehydrated. And he's like, oh boy, dude. I can't wait to eat a nice and delicious round meal that my freaking wife just made for me. Oh boy. And then boom. Log. Have you bought a new mug yet? No, I have my Golden Gromit mug. I'm not worried about it. I don't need a new mug just yet. Okay, I kind of see where it wants me to go from there. All right. Oh, shit. I don't think I have any food that recharges stamina at the moment, do I? I'm a little goofy guy, aren't I? I'm a little goofy guy. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. It's fine. We can get up there through here, probably. I thought I, I, I'm not gonna go splat again. I'm not gonna fall on my own fucking face. You're never gonna laugh at me again. You're never gonna laugh at me again. All right, uppies. Uh, how do I? There we go. I have one more shield with a rocket on it. Leave it to me. Oh boy, Koroxy. They're making little shapes. They're having fun with it. I'm proud of them. The world is literally falling apart. Nightmares are descending upon us. You know what we should do? Hide a bunch of funny rocks everywhere. Dude, I was just thinking about that. We should hide a bunch of funny rocks everywhere. That's literally all I'm about right now is hiding funny little rocks everywhere. It's the shit in it. It's the shit. Hiding funny little rocks is literally my existence. Thanks, little dude. Appreciate you. There we go. Funny slime man. I didn't mean to do that. Gotta say, I like the looks of a lot of the enemy part fusion weapons that remind me of Monster Hunter. Yeah, the enemy fusion... I, I felt like when I was playing... Um, when, I, when I was playing Breath of the Wild, I felt like I was always wasting monster parts. To some degree. Like, I never thought I was utilizing them properly. I was always like, you know what? I'm not using these monster parts correctly. I'm just using them for potions, and that's, like, it. And one nice thing about Breath of the Wild, per or Tears of the Kingdom, personally, is I don't feel like I'm misusing my monster parts. I feel like I'm saving them so I can have better weapons. And I never feel really bad about that, so... Silly guys... ...to fight.
Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Fear? Got him. Thick stick. Because with the monster parts in this one, they really are a lot larger. And I do feel a lot, lot, lot better about weapons when it comes to, like, there are a lot of base weapons. Ooh, shit. Ouchies. Thanks, gamer. Oh, I forgot that I'm fucking cold right now, aren't I? Oop. Goofed around and found out, didn't I? Here we go. Please drop arrow. Thank you for the free arrows. I'm stupid, though, because I need... Hold resist. There we go. Okay. Link! Yeah, there's me. That's my freaking name. I am freaking Link, dude. I am linking the fuck out, too. Oh, free arrow. Bread, bread or weapons? Bread or weapons. A matter of loaf or death. Bread or weapon. What will you fight for? Hello, creature. I need your stuff. I want your orbs. I can buy rockets with these orbs. Brennan needs to find those bouncy mushrooms so we can do the home, ru home run bad again. I, I still don't know how that shit worked, yeah. What am I doing? I'm fucking being silly about it. I forget. You know what I fucking have? Tuffy. Let's see, though. Can I get up here from there? Close, close. I get full stamina back. All right, I'm figuring it out. We can kind of get up here and get pretty normal with it. There we go. All right, we're getting closer to it. Oh God, he's going to, they're going to be dropping orbs on us, aren't they? Get him? Got him. Who? Woo! There's one. I gotta worry about the other one. I gotta worry about you. Oh, dude, I keep forgetting I have the homing eyeballs. I can literally just shoot them out of the sky. Where are my eyeballs at? Where are my keys eyeballs at? I can just fucking blow them out of the sky. Just like that. This whole fuck. I keep for I keep forgetting... That's the problem, is like, uh, Zelda does that, where you just have so much shit that you can potentially do. So much shit you can do. Hmm. Hi. Oh. 
I can't fucking believe I just realized oh. Tulin has the ability of Inuyasha from Inuyasha. He can fucking wind scar. <laughs> what did he say? What do you want, dude? Easy peasy, we just ascend. Ooh, am I out of... Yeah, I'm out of... I'm just gonna have to live and then go and... Oh, wait. It was around here that I saw Princess Zelda, but I don't know where she could have gone. Mm -hmm. Boat! That is a really cool boat. Uh, do I have hot? I gotta make a yummy meal. I gotta make a hot meal. Sorry, dude. I gotta make a hot meal, stat. Sorry, I gotta make some hot meat, dude. I'm so fucking sorry. Need me a hot meat right now. There we go. Hot meat. What the boat do? Oh, piss in the sky. Is it Zelda trying to guide us? She up there? <gasps> Come. Come. Dude, I don't even know you. Come to me. Okay, all right. First I was like, dude, I don't even know you. Come. Come. They got the big boat up there. Two boats. She's on the boat. It's one of the four big dungeons. Seems pretty fucking cool. And I will uh, be, do it the next time I play Zelda, which I should take a break from Zelda tomorrow when I'm playing other game. I should play other games so people can actually watch stream instead of worry about spoiler. So that's the stream for tonight. Uh, stayed up way later than I thought I was, but of course I'm Zelda obsessed. So thank you all for coming to the stream. Uh, creator code Brendan Anley. If you buy anything in the Epic Games store, helps me out a ton. If you don't use the Epic Games store, don't worry about it. And there's always videos over on the second channel. Uh, I link those both in chat. Hope you all have a good rest of your freaking night or morning. Uh, I'm going to go to bed. So, bye.